Three, two, one. The stars, my darling, boys, but the strange and vast, filled with wonders and joys, bathes each new sun with eyes clear and true. I'm afraid of the unknown, because I'm busy all with you. Hello, everybody. How you all doing? Good to see you. Good to see you. So happy to see you. We're going to be doing some more... <laughs> We're actually probably going to be doing some script writing because I don't think I've written uh, the next portion of it. And i got to make sure that I write it down. Welcome on in, everybody. First prelude. Welcome on in. Stephanie. Hello. Verita. Welcome on in. And Keep. How you doing, yo? All to you, hellos. Oh, how you all doing? What are you up to? What are you? What do you? What is? What is? What is in your background at the current moment? What is on the back of your mind? Uh for me, I've got a, I got a couple other things that I've uh, attached to the stream. Actually, um, I've been trying to figure out how I could possibly use the, um use the uh the little uh avatar that's inside of motion 
and um, I've got I got I got I got I got I got a couple ideas. And right now, it's just a punching bag until I can actually get another computer, which would be probably about four thousand dollars, which is uh, I don't know, for, until I can get a computer, which is about $4,000, which I've priced out, will be about $5,000 away. <laughs> yes, yeah, something that costs $4,000 no, $4, is about $5,000 away from me actually obtaining it. It always seems like I'm in the negative direction. However, however, uh, I do have something of a punching bag variety for uh later on if anybody choose so we i do have uh one doohickey right now which is uh they've added channel points to motion so now there's the ability to take a tour of the of the streaming area which should work i don't know why that didn't work out of stock check back later out of stock what does that mean out of stock check back later hold on Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, edit. Okay, let me set this up to two and then save it. Yeah, that didn't make any sense because I haven't even pressed the button once. That made no sense. Uh, also, slap doesn't do anything. Take a tour. Redeem. There we go. Now the take a tour thing actually just uh, goes ahead and... Uh, does a uh, nice camera sweep of the area. Goes from one camera to the other. So I'm glad that they've uh, upped some of this stuff. I think they've uh, also reduced some usage of some items inside of uh, inside of the motion. But uh, yeah, just finished work. So time to rest. Good, 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 good. Well. It's time for me to get to work. So let us go ahead and we're going to change this over to open recent. We're going to go to Steampunk Parts Store 5, Tango's House, and we're going to actually write up some script. That's the one thing that I forgot to put in here. I was trying to get everything set up. So that everything was uh, nice and organized for me for the stream, but I failed on that task. All right, Tango's house. I'm going to need to open up a few windows here. Let's go to Gmail. Hi, Gmail. It's going to take you forever to run since I have 20,000 things in the background, isn't it? Do, 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 do. And then, all right, nothing there, nothing there. Good, 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 good. Let's go ahead and go to the drive of this folder. And this should be Tango's house, right? Tango's house. Here we go. Okay. So I uh, we left we left off with uh, the pretty horses telling Puka that the what they need to do is right across the street. So that's that's where we left everything off so we're not we may not do be doing a lot of animation today but we did leave off on this to give something back horse not well, good oh my god hey he now, said it he said don't, it don't swear those words have power you know especially around people with demonic powers is that why you like being around me it's part of the reason no need to worry about randomly summoning fell spirits up until now. Okay, so how can I help you right this terrible sin that you have committed? Well, like, um, it's easier if we, like, just showed you. It's right across the street. Alright, so from there, I need to write in their conversation as they walk across the street. And I need, I need it to be... Uh, horrifyingly hilarious, because they're going to be talking about uh, giving money to uh, the robot. However, they do need to actually have a little bit of a conversation as they start walking up to the door as well. So they need to walk up to the door and say a few things, and then they need to go through, and I pretty much have the script laid out for as they walk across the street. But getting up to the door, I don't know... 
I don't know if we're about getting up to the viewer. Um. Alright, so I do... I should put in something... Mm, it's right across the street. Maybe we could uh, make up some... Make up some shops or something like that. I can never hear that one bit right. Summoning what? Summoning what? I can never hit hear that one bit right. Summoning what? You've lost me completely, Vera. <laughs> oh, summoning a fil foul spirit. I'm sorry. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I have to remember that, uh, the delay a bit. I have to remember the delay. It's called a fell spirit. As in F-E-L. Fell is a type of, uh, demonic power that is commonly used in, uh, fantasy. I know fell energy is a type of thing that's used within World of Warcraft. That's, a that's what all the, that's what all the Burning Legion uses, is is a type of foul energy. So, demonic energy. Um, so, let's see here. Uh, uh, let's see here. I want... So, it's just... It's easier if we show you. It's just across the street. I need to... I need to give some sort of company or something that... A fictional company that exists within this universe. So it's going to be in a building that's right across the street from here. So let's see here. If we go... If we go this way. And we're going to go... I'm going to bring on some textures here really quickly. And I want to do look across the street. Uh, land outside extra buildings. Let's take a look at outside extra buildings here. So we're going to be going through these doors. We're going to be uh, talking to a few people. And then we're going to be landing in this kind of like area here. Uh... So it's just right across the street. And uh, I, as he's walking across this area here, he needs to say a few things. So from here to there. Which is like, okay, is it in the such and such building? No, no, no. It's just in the uh, vacant lot left by the blah, blah, blah. Uh. It's just like, okay, is it in the something something? No, it's in the vacant lot left by the blah blah blah. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. I got an idea. I got an idea. Okay, some sort of lemonade stand comes to mind. Is the vacant lot lot left by the uh, children's lemonade stand that we I don't know sort of killed or something like that? I don't know. Something horrifying, but. But the building that has all of these dark bricks here, it needs to it needs to have also a a name or something like that. Like what 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 is across the street? What type of uh, building is there? Um, it needs to be a factory or something like that. Chicken and egg noodles. Our slogan is it doesn't matter. What came first? Both are delicious. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, that's kind of sending me down a different path. Uh, because they could, because Puka could say something like, uh, like, a, oh, is it in the chicken and egg noodle um, factory? And they're like, nope. No, it's not that. Oh, you remember their slogan? <laughs> Doesn't matter which came first, it, they're both delicious. 
It needs to be, I don't know, a little bit more horrifying. Horrifying yet family friendly. That's what I'm kind of looking for. Horrifying and family friendly. <laughs> uh... Let's see here. Mm. But yeah, they, they could they could say something along those lines. Inside the we're gonna put in uh blank uh blank factory. Factory question mark and then we're gonna do pretty horses. Like you remember their slogan, but you remember their slogan, um, something, 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 something. Firefox, how you doing, yo? Good to see you. Welcome on in. Something, something, something. <laughs> And then by that time, by the time they say those two lines, the uh, Puka starts walking out and says uh, that, and the pretty horses finish that line. Puka's gonna be opening up the doors, and we lay down, Remy. I'm gonna tell you one more time to lay down. Thank you very much, Remy. Ah, uh, all right. Something, something. I'm good. Uh, just building some revamped villager builds in a light-o-matic test uh, build world. Oh, okay. Hmm. <sighs> Chicken and egg noodles. Hmm. I think we're going to just stick with that until then. Jingle and or slogan, depending on getting uh, the pretty horses to sing. <laughs> True. <laughs> uh... oh, what it... Do you want it to be called Stephanie's? Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Noodles? <laughs> Chicken and egg noodles. Mm. Okay with that? Okay. Inside. Inside, not the. So it's going to be inside. Mm. Steph. Stephanie's. Egg. Or chicken and uh, chicken and egg chicken and egg factory. Uh, nope. But, but you remember their slogan? No matter what, just came first. Their slogan is. You remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. Which came first? They're both delicious. They're both delicious. <laughs> we'll go with that for now until we can think of something out. Just watch the Schizzleman in Impulse Scar animation of <laughs> Mufasa's death. <laughs> Yeah, that was fun. Hello! Welcome on in. Mm -hmm. I think we're gonna go with that. And then we've got to uh let's 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 pull this over here so that way we can uh write it down a little bit uh together here. 
So, Puka's gonna be walking across the street. Uh, nope, 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 nope. Don't do that. Please don't do that. Back up, back up. There we go. Alright, so Puka's gonna be walking across the street. The moment he opens up the door, he's gonna be confronted by two robots. And both robots are gonna be, like, poor robots, and they're gonna be asking him for money. Uh, they both have to say something. They both have to say something, because one of them is going to be Zack the Dragon voicing them. Uh, Puka opens the doors and is immediately confronted by two steampunk robots still don't know what they're gonna look like but they're gonna look like something <laughs> if i just have to put a single gear on their back or something like that just to give them bad uh steampunk robots um uh robo robo one pardon me do you have any change Something like that, I would suppose. Um, par, pardon, pardon me, pardon me. Does you, does you? I think a does you is probably better. Does you? Squeeze me, or should I say squeeze me? Squeeze me, does you? Sque squeeze me, does you? <laughs> <laughs> but and pardons 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 sounds a little bit more broken pardons pardons does you does you has does you has spare spare coin does he has spor spare coin pardons does you has spare coin and we need to do a Robo 2. Robo 2. And what should I have? What should I have? Uh, what should I have um, Robo 2 say? Uh, this is going to be Zack the Dragon talking. Um, we not but poor robots. We not... But poor robots. We not but poor robots. No, 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 no. Not robots. Robots. We don't want mm, robots. We want robots. Okay. We not but poor robots. <laughs> we not but poor robots. We not but poor robots. Because that's exactly how Zack the Dragon sounds, right? It sounds exactly like. Excuse me, Miss Turner. You're in a ghost story, I say. Poor bloke. We not but poor brokers. Poor broker robots. Poor broke robots. Poor broke robots. Poor, poor broke. Poor broke robots. Yeah, because broke has a different, another, another meaning to it, doesn't it? Yeah, that's a good idea. We not but poor broke robots. And we could probably actually, yeah, actually, let me put that down in one of my notes. Uh. Uh, ideas for this. Uh, have outfit is not looking some too hot right now. You need something that looks prettier. Outfit change. Be broken. Have some of the arms be broken. Uh, oh, that for for the robot. For the robot. There we go. All right. I assume that that was Veritas, and Sue has access to that. <laughs> Which one are we doing? Just one of them? Doesn't matter? Let's figure this out then. We want... Date modified... Let's do, Let's see how big Megazord is, right? How, how big is Megazord? Oh, that's right. I gotta go there. Uh-oh. Whoop. Yep. Well. 
Well, would you look at that? Hmm. Doesn't seem like a uh, Megazord is. Ah. Uh... Hello, I am a collection of pixels. If you've wandered into the negative zones levels of any video game, I might look familiar to you. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll just continually kill your character till you run out of lives. <laughs> Alright, let's go for the small one so that we can actually see something. Megazord's small. There we go. Oh, let's get rid of those gaggles. We need to get rid of the gaggles. Gaggles, gone. There we go. So small. So small! <laughs> I don't have a camera to zoom out, zoom out anymore. Uh... Or, or wait, 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 do I? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, well, this is a real big zoom out. You can see the lava tail over there, but... <laughs> ah, there's the shulkers. So there's the shulkers. I see them. Uh, the, the, uh, the, the, the fish chest. The fish chest, the strider leg, the uh, pelvis. Strider pelvis, I would say. Strider pelvis, and, and then the, uh, Oh, no, no, wait. Oh, I thought I thought the chest was the salmon. No, 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 the chest isn't the salmon. Okay, the chest... The salmon is one of the foot. Right foot. Kick you one with one of my fishy legs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fish is the boot. Fish is the boot. Speaking of robots, yeah. All the buttons. That's not going to work very well. No, it's not. <laughs> uh... And at first, I thought that was a, a plus sign on my head, and I was some sort of nurse. <laughs> nurse Zord. Zord Nurse. I have come to hail your ailments with my sword. Pink is Becca's phantom. Ah, okay. Okay. Now, this took some time to put together, didn't it? It took a lot of time. Alright, we're gonna keep it at the Zord for right now. We're gonna keep it at the Zord. Zord. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we got uh some other things in here too. Uh ba -ba 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 -ba. take tour of the stream. Mass explode. Ah. We do have uh if if you feel generous. Fuzzy Cat 4, thank you very much for the follow. I appreciate that, yo. Super appreciate that. If you guys want to hurt me with a single bit at a time, we do have we do have this set up. But it's like a, a channel point trigger that'll come up to here. And oh yeah, that's right. I need to put in the commands into the Twitch, don't I? I need to put the commands into the Twitch. Whoop. Over here. Let me put that into the into the Twitch, shall I? Because channel open link a new tab. It's a specific command for some of these guys to actually activate. And muting the stream doesn't work. Hello. Ah. Clicking mute on my own stream doesn't work. How how <laughs> How wonderful. Okay, and we want um uh bit attack mode, bit attack mode. Uh click the uh what is the what is the channel point thingy for that? What is the channel point thingy for that? That is 500 bits. Hurt Puka. Click the Hurt Puka channel point. Uh, channel point redemption. Uh, then use these commands with 
bits with bits and then it would be launch launch uh number number and then uh one bit and then the other one is creeper creeper 100 bit i think creeper 100 bit actually still works in any mode i think i got it set up for that all right i have a a text panel set up for that should be the top text panel so bit attack mode there we go all right now let's get rid of this panel so that way i'm not streaming my own stream like three times three different times by jove hello oh yeah he does uh can have a sword oh cold all right cold ah uh Cold. Cold? There. There's the sword. It's back there. Sort of. <laughs> it's back there, sort of. It, it wiggles a bit. The sword wiggles a bit. I get angry, though. That's what's the important part is. This, the sword that can stab with a look. Puka time. Hey, Puka. How's it going? Did you have a good weekend? Did I have a good weekend? This is my weekend. <laughs> so since I worked third shift uh, dairy stalker, third shift dairy stalker, this is my weekend. So today and tomorrow. So I stream on my days off. Because I have so much fun doing it. Because I enjoy making fun of the pretty horses. Um... Puka is going to say, Puka, uh, oh, yeah, sure. Oh, yeah, sure, sure, here. And then the pretty horses will say, um, don't, don't give them, like, any money. Uh, don't like, uh, don't give them, like, any money. Oh, my God. Just don't. Uh, Puka says, why not? Why not? Exclamation point. Uh, and then pretty horses. They say something along the lines of... Uh, they don't have souls. They don't have souls. They don't have souls. Puka. Uh, oh, robots. Actually, robots don't have souls. Robots don't have souls. Robots. Robots don't have souls. This is like... How would you know they don't have souls? Says Puka. And pretty horses say... Uh, believe... Believe us. We have tried. Believe us, we tried. Ah, yeah. Okay, so we need to take out the have. We tried. Believe us, we tried. Puka? What do you mean you tried? <laughs> what do you mean you tried? Uh, pretty horses. Long story short. Uh... We had a net gain of zero souls. We had it. Long story short, we had a net gain of zero souls. Oh my god. Just like nothing. There ain't nothing inside of those robots. <laughs> oh, net, we had a net gain of zero souls and lots of spare parts. Yeah, that's right. That's what I needed to do. Uh... 
Puka. Spare parts? Exclamation point. I suddenly... Um... Uh, suddenly... Am questioning where my stock comes from. <laughs> I'm suddenly... Spare parts? I'm suddenly questioning where my stock comes from. <laughs> oh... Uh, robot 1 could have a missing bolt and uh, robot 2 could spark at random times. Good point. Good point. Let me put that in there. I like that idea. Let's go ahead and put those into random things because I just had broken parts. Ba -ba 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 Add sparks and bolts falling. There we go. Something like that. Ah. Jonah, hello. Did you know that milk helps uh, with bone resistance? Bone resistance? I don't want any bones. No, don't, don't give me any bones. <laughs> Gotta keep them bones away. Gotta keep them bones away. Hey, Toa! Never uh, YouTube channel for a while, and I am now busy working on the scenes on my own YouTube channel for thinking about lore, trying to out the MCs, MC mods. They fit together well, improving my Minecraft skills. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I remember you mentioning that you're uh, working on your lore. Hope that's going okay. Back with Noms. Hello. Has he checked the sword? Yeah, it, it only makes my uh, it only makes my face uh, face go gur, gur, and it wiggles the sword a little bit back there. That's that's <laughs> that's what it's done. It wiggles the sword. Because if we go to this camera view, and then we do cold, nothing nothing really happens over there either too. So, it, it, it just makes my ang uh, anger face come out. Just the anger face. Anger face. Do ba do ba do. Mm -bum -bum. Have to set the slider. I have to set the slider. Oh. Hydrate. Is that a hydrate? Yeah, it's a hydrate and a save. Oh, uh, we got things saved. That's good. And we got to do hydrate. <laughs> Hello, Sarah. Sarah Sayers. Pokemon in. An impulse wave. Impulse wave. Got the impy dimpy doc Dr. Professor Dippledop wave. Um... What was I after? Hydrate. We got that. Save. Yes, we got that. Oh, oh, sliders. Sliders. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need to figure out if there's a way to fix that. Because I don't think so. Let's see here. Uh, motion. Uh, hotkeys. Here we go. Camera pose. No. ABC. That's right. That's right. That's right. Okay. Uh, cold. Let's do this. And we want to do what? Uh, I squint, tongue out, tongue out. Say, uh, cold, ka -ching, tail sword. Okay. Let's go to this, this mode right here. Let's go to tail sword. Oh, cannons <laughs> and lava off okay okay there we go 
Now we have a tail sword. <laughs> why? Why is the sword looking at me? That's that's a question. Why? Why is the sword looking at me? Is it a singing sword? Gerbang. Oh, oh, those are those are potted plants. Uh, those are pottery. <laughs> I see the texture you use there. <laughs> All right, here we go. And let's hit okay on that. So now now we can bring out now we can bring out that. So we can go cold. Arr. <laughs> all right, it's all set up. Okay, good. Potted plants. Fear my potted plants. The sword judges you before it executes you. <laughs> Just like you really shouldn't have done that. I'm sorry. I, I'm not the one bringing the hammer down or the sword down. Huh? <laughs> um we need over here spare parts i'm suddenly questioning where my stock comes from okay so from the table from the table and walking outwards uh they need to uh start they need to start saying something like, uh, it's easier if we just showed you. It's right across the street. Then Puka says, uh, inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory? Nope. But, like, uh, you remember their slogan? Don't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> uh, Puka then opens the door and immediately, uh, confronted by two steampunk robots. It's like, pardon me, does hell spare coin? It's like, we not but poor robots. Uh, yeah, uh, sure. Uh, don't give them any, like, uh, any money. Why not? Robots don't have souls. How would you know they don't have souls? Believe us, we tried. What do you mean you tried? Uh, long story short, we had, like, a net gain of zero souls and, uh, lots of spare parts. Spare part? I'm suddenly questioning where all of my stock comes from. <laughs> that might be enough that might be enough to get across the street uh let's see here mm, do, 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 do. Uh, i guess i could record that and see about and see about uh how long that's gonna take in terms of giving out uh the amount of time to get across the street so that's gonna be a difficult animation difficult bit of animation but i think i can get through it for sure all right that's gonna be definitely today and tomorrow for that should robots uh cower in fear while uh pretty horses explain why <laughs> you know what they should they should cower in fear when they see the horses <laughs> like the moment they start walking out the doors they're just like oh god it's them <laughs> uh let's see here all right we want to do a file and we don't want to do a save project save project as yeah i know i know, I know. Steampunk 4, um, main audio 2 is what we're going to be calling it. Main audio 2. So let me grab my script. Script it? A script. It. Uh, ah, I know. Thank you very much, puppy. You can't see it, but the puppy that's down by my feet is uh is definitely just shoving his nails into me that's a delight you can at least see two of them up there one's on the couch being looked at by the creeper and the other one's uh behind the creeper kind of on the floor there both of them are nicely asleep oh hi sorry did i wake you akila 
You'll go puppy. I know. So sleepy. Such a sleepy puppy. Oh. Don't be digging on the couch. Are you sleeping with my pants? Why did you drag one of my pants up there? You're a silly doggo, okay? Just to let you know that. Here, I'll get you something to cover up with. There we go. Puppy needs something to cover up with. Alright. So, let's see here. Easy if we should just show you. Uh, and then we start recording from about there. No! Don't do that to me! There we go. Um, inside Stephanie's warehouse? No, not Stephanie. As I try to do things, I don't. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory? Oh, that's right. I wanted to, I wanted to put in some sort of like, um... Uh, um, something else in there too. It's still, del it's delicious. <laughs> I wanted to put in, um, oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. It's delicious. And the other pretty horse says something along the lines of, um, the vacant, vacant, lot uh where we scared away the lem lemonade stand <laughs> uh the vacant lot where we scared away the lemonade stand <laughs> I think that'll do. Noms have been eaten. Uh, were we scared away the lemonade stand? Um, mm. <laughs> or bake sale. I think I think I'm gonna where we I I maybe not lemonade stand. Let's go with bake sale. Where we eating the vacant lot where we skating uh scared away the the bake sale. Bake bake sale. Um Um <laughs> Those muffins looked at me wrong. I don't know, those muffins looked at me wrong. Something like that. Those muffins looked at me wrong. <laughs> I don't know. That seems proper. I see that I could uh, disconnect the hand bones. Ah, on the Megazord. Oops. So what's happening in this scene while the characters are saying this? Oh, they're just walking across the street. That's that's what they're doing. They're going to be walking across the street. They're going to be going outside the Stingpunk parts store. And they're going to be just walking across the street to uh, uh, where they uh, have Tango's house. Which I still need to build. <laughs> it's, Tango's house is uh, kind of uh, difficult to build. Because I'm working on uh, building it up from watching his videos. Okay. Mm, yes. No, but do you like remember their slogan? Mm. 
No, but... No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first. They're both delicious. Chicken flesh. <laughs> okay, that's good. That's good. I like that. Uh, let's squeeze this down a little bit. And then let's bring in a track, add new, stereo track, add new, stereo track. And we want to bring this down. Uh, doesn't matter which came first. They're both delicious. And then we're gonna give, uh, give that line to the other horse. So one horse will this have this line. And then one horse will have this line. And then they both laugh together. And then one of them says chicken flesh. <laughs> One of them says chicken flesh. <laughs> uh, I love random humor. Random humor is the best. Uh, by the way, you should find uh, the way to view the boots of the Megazord. Both of them blink. Uh, at the current moment, kind of not really. Uh, I'd have to do some, uh, motion, motion, uh, fixing. And at the current moment, motion is not going to let me uh, do too much, uh, fixing. I do want to get, uh, some more controls, but I'm running out of controls as it were. Uh, actually, hmm, I wonder... I wonder actually, hold on, let me get, let me, uh, come up with an idea. I might be able to do something in motion. Um, uh, kill camera. Where's the kill camera at? Kill cam, there it is. So this is the kill cam. And then, oh no, that's the kill cam. And I need the attack cam. Attack cam, I want as a default, uh,. Uh, left alt, we want F13, maybe? Let's try that. Okay, so if we go to mainstream right now, and then we go to here, we minimize here, and then we do an alt. Okay, there we go. No, that's, that's still kill cam. Um, I'm blinking, but it's not giving me... Oh, no, there they are. They're blinking. Okay, I see them. Let me go back to F1. Why doesn't motion do that properly? I thought I set it to... Oh, no, that's F1. F2, F4, F6, F7, F8... F13. No! No. Oh! End stream. No, no, no. F13. Left out. 9, 10, 11, and 12. Okay. It should be left alt. Oh, that's left control. Okay. Left control 13. No, but, uh, left alt. Now, what is left control, then, 13? There we go. Okay, so left control, 13. I don't know what, uh, left alt button was. Let's go to minimize that. And then, so I can go to that. And then to this, right? There we go. 
Okay, so now I can see it blinking. There we go. Alright. Much better. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, sorry to take you on that trip. <laughs> oh gosh, you guys can't hear that. I need to I need to set that up. Uh sources. What do we need? We need to add in one of those audio sources, don't we? Audio captures. Uh-oh. The R is coming in. Hello, the R. Um Audacity. How you doing, everybody? Welcome on in. We are doing some setup for some animations. We're uh, writing the script, and doing the voice acting, and then we're going to be animating. All in the same stream. All in the same stream. I'd be asking what you were up to, Liara, but I was watching you play the game that I barely understand. Barely understand. Oh, Zach! Hey! 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 Hey, I got a I got a line for you. Currently it's just one line, but uh we're up to that point right now. Uh we want Audacity. Where is DLC Blender Audacity? There it is. Okay. Bring this down a little bit just in case. Alright. So currently currently currently, Zach. Um we're working on the scene where Puka and the horses are going to be walking through the door. And they're going to be confronted with two steampunk robots. Um, and uh, one of them uh, will be voice acted by me. And the other one will be voice acted by you. And then they walk across the street where they run into Tango's house there. Okay? So, currently... <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I got it. I got it, I got it. I got I got another line that I could have you have in there too. Uh What do you mean you've tried? Um I'm going to put in a line here. Um in the background uh robot 2. I I'm, I'm calling them robots, not robots. Robot 2 uh yells out uh oh god exclamation point it's them because <laughs> they're gonna look at the horses and run away so right now we're we're gonna be going from inside the steampunk parts store and across the street to the vacant lot that's what we're doing <laughs> uh it's a megazord Yes, yes. I'm currently at Megazord because of Zach the Dr uh, not Zach Dr uh, because of Veritai. However, if you guys want to, let's take a look at what I normally look like. What I normally look like, let's bring it down to kind of Link. Link kind of feels a little bit steam steampunky, honestly. He feels a little bit more steampunky. Like this. Hi. <laughs> a little bit better. A little bit better, right? Oh, and in case anybody is wondering what it is I do, what does Puka do? Here's something for you. What does Puka do? I know I've lost the goggles. Ah, there's the goggles. It's spelled like Google, but without uh, the extra O. <laughs> Let's put a randomize on that music. Raid. Making sure that I haven't missed anybody's text. Um. So, uh, currently, Zach, the the script goes like this. 
Uh... Uh, it's easier if we just showed you. It's across the street. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> chicken flesh. Uh, the vacant lot where... Um, oh, no, no, they said. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins were looking at me wrong. <laughs> Puka goes through the doors. Uh, pardon me, do does you have a spare coin? Says Robot 1. Robot 2 says, um... We but not broke robots. Uh, oh, yeah, uh, sure, here you go. Don't give them any money. Why not? Robots don't have any souls. How would you know they don't have any souls? Believe us, we tried. What do you mean you tried? One of the robots says, Oh God, it's them! Uh, long story short, we had a net gain of zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I'm suddenly questioning where my stock comes from. <laughs> so that is, that is the walk across the street. Ah, uh, script. So we are getting that nicely voice acted. So I will, uh, if you want, Robot 2. He switches so, so fluently. Uh, uh, yeah. When you do the pretty horse's voice for over, I don't know, what is it, eight years? <laughs> it's a little easy. Uh, Robot 2, uh, and then in the background, uh, copy. So, there's Robot 2 line, and ro and in the background, you hear that. Those, those are the two lines. I can give them to you, uh, in Discord as well, if you so choose. Teddy! Give him the lurk. Thank you very much for lurking. I appreciate you, yo. Alrighty, let us go ahead and do a thingy. Let us go and audacity. That's what we needed. Audacity. Audacity. Nah. -huh. <laughs> Suddenly, I'm reminded of Impulse's little thing of ah ha. -huh. <laughs> uh, what am I? What am I gonna be working on right now? Ah. Audacity. <laughs> Audacity. So you roped Zach into your madness then. Yes! Zach is gonna be a robot. Uh Discord, please. I need to I need to prioritize work uh for a bit. Oh no problems. Volunteer, yep. He volunteered and then I s then I uh um shoehorned him in there. Just sh shoved somewhere. <laughs> Just like, can I voice act? Like, sure, why not? <laughs> uh, so we have inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory. No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> chicken flesh. <laughs> gosh. Oh, that's terrible. I don't. Uh, gosh. Okay. So we need to do. Um, it's the vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. That didn't flow out correctly. Hold on, huh? The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Do this. And do this. And then bring this down here. I want to get rid of a bit of this so that it can overlap. Because when you're working with the same voice for two different characters, it's easy if things uh, overlap so that... You can hear, you can hear the fact that there's two characters. It's what a bunch of the people do when they do um, skits with just themselves, and they have the same voice for uh, several different characters. If they overlap the voices, it, it helps to identify between two different people, or multiple different people sometimes. So, okay, let's give that a save. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Move that forward. Move this back. There we go. These muffins looked at me wrong. Um, 
Pardons, does that you have spare coin? He sounds a little too cheerful. Hold on. Hold on. Pardons. And I started that way too soon. Pardons, does you have spare coin? And then we want to move this over here. We're just going to give uh, just a space for Zach for right now. So I'm going to do a fantastic impression of Zach the Dragon right now. You ready for this? You ready for this? Okay. We've not but broke robots. Perfect. Perfect. Couldn't do any better than that. <laughs> Spot on, right? You best be believing in steampunk, Miss Turner. You're in one. <laughs> All right, let's move this on over. Move this on over. <laughs> uh. Uh, do, 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 do. Chicken flesh, the bacon <laughs> lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons, does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Clearful. Complete voices of the horses bonding over the phrase chicken flesh. <laughs> live in my head rent free i'm not uh i'm at work to move <laughs> i am extremely happy thank you very much <laughs> uh all right we not been broke robots all right oh yeah yeah sure here you go Go bring this on over here. Uh, do 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 do. We not but broke robots. Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, don't give them like any money, Puka. There's a slap right there, isn't there? Don't give them. Yeah, it's a slap. I don't like that. When I accidentally slap with my lips when I'm about to talk, it, it sounds so irritating. It's just like, oh yeah, now I can talk. <laughs> just, just, just let me get my uh, face out of the way and then I can speak. <laughs> Man, my face, it's always in the way when I'm trying to say something. <laughs> Uh, let's see here. Uh, do, 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 do. What? Why not? Mm, that sounded a little too high for Puka. What? Why not? What? Why not? Mm, do, 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 do. Why not? There we go. We'll do that. We'll do that. That sounds a little bit better. Give a little bit of contrast in between uh, the horses and Puka. Can't give it away that they're both from the same vocal cords. Once you start overlapping, then uh, it breaks the immersion. Gotta stay in immersion. Three, two, one, pretty horses. Oh my god! <laughs> Uh, what do you mean you tried souls? Why not? Robots don't have souls. Robots don't have souls. Robots don't have souls. Maybe, maybe, uh, blah, blah, blah. Robots don't have souls. <laughs> that sounds terrible. Let's do that. Robots don't have souls. Yeah, that sounds much more condescending. Much more condescending. I like that. 
Yeah, there we go. Hot but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. <laughs> mm. Okay. And how would you know? Or, nope. Let's, uh. And how would you know? Mm, that's for some reason quiet. And how would you know? Go. Uh, oh! That didn't work. Oh! Why didn't that work? It didn't work. I don't know why it didn't work. Hold on. Hold on. We'll fix that. We'll fix it! So, Firefox, you've hit that little button over there, the Hurt Puka thingy. Uh, anybody that wants to can use the commands down there, which uh, happen to be, what is it, a launch? Launch. And then you can put in a couple numbers, like so, and it costs uni one bit. Unfortunately, I can't cheer to myself, but... It's that plus uh, a single bit, and you can toss a bit at me, if you so choose. Hmm, doesn't work. It's kind of words. I had a backup, which is why... <laughs> I'm, I'm doing anything that's in motion, I have a backup command for now. Because uh, since motion is in beta, when things don't work, I want them to have a, a backup at least. So... Stream information, uh, Twitch dashboard. Here we go. Hurt Puka. So, uh, sorry. Yeah, sorry about that, Firefox. For some reason, that didn't work. Let's do a mark is complete, mark is complete, and mark is complete. So, launch, number, number, and then one bit, and you can toss a bit at me and try and kill me. I think it's like five hits, and then I can go down. Either that, or it's uh, 100 bits at any time, and the creeper explodes. So, <laughs> but we do still have this stream in the background, though. Slap. Oh, yeah, slap doesn't work. I need to refund your points on that. Yeah, we're going to give those points back to you. Because I was working on slap, because for some reason, I found out that um, the there is a limit to the number of channel point redemptions that you can have. And I didn't know that. It's just like, oh. Why, why, why can't I do that? So I set it up for slap first and then never took slap away. So slaps away. There we go. Slap away. <laughs> so we'll leave that up for a little bit if you so choose. And in the meantime, we'll go ahead and continue on giving some voice acting as well. Um, I did, I did want to see if I could, um, set up, uh, VC face somehow to do that. Oh, yeah, yeah, uh. oh, yeah, that's right. No, I can't set up VC face to do that because I only have one face cam, uh, at the moment. Only one face cam. So sad. Wait a minute. It's only been an hour. I've only been working on this for an hour. It feels forever. You guys have packed this and packed this entire hour with so much fun. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. It's been so much fun. Ah, uh, all right. Robots don't have souls. How would you know? How would you know? And then we got to put that up there next to Puka. And then we got to bring this in a bit. Um. Long story short, we had, like, a net gain of, like, zero souls and, like, no spare parts. I mean, oh, my God, that was completely screwed up because I messed up the lines. Oh, my God, let me try again. Makeup. Oh, my God. Let's go again. Okay. Long story short, we had a net gain of, like, zero souls and, like, lots of... <laughs> yeah, it's your fault. The guy was walking across the back with the lights. Oh, my gosh. And we're done professionally. 
done. Just done. Okay, try again. Long story short, we have like a deck gain of like zero souls and lots of spare parts. <laughs> it took me a while to actually get that out there. It was a mess flubbing up my lines. Flubbing them up. I need to get those lines a little bit better. These two days were you stream is a highlight of my week. Thank you for making it fun to be here. Go for around with you. Uh, I assume the still puka right now uh, is in motion. Motion? Motion? Yes, it is in motion. Yes. Because, let's see here. I think I can. I think I can. Let's see here. Is it, uh, if I set it up for this. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Editor, they're here. Where's launch? Launch. Yeah. Uh, play. Boop. Beep, beep, beep. Yeah, that can do that. And then if you kill Puka, beep. pop. <laughs> Wasted. Pop. Right back to here. And then... Did I... Okay, it goes back to the kill, uh, the attack cam. Ba -ba -ba. Alrighty then. Well, I'm sorry, Fire, uh, Firefox. It doesn't look like anybody wants to play. So, we're just going to go ahead and give you back those points, though. We're just going to go ahead and give you back those points, and we'll just head back to this camera right here. I'm glad I had that set up. Do, 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 do. Sounds like uh, the pretty horses are in need of <laughs> understudy for those occasions when they fail to remember their job. Yeah, they're not used to actually doing work. They are not working horses by any stretch of the imagination. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. Spare part? Lots of spare parts. Spare part? Lots of spare parts. Spare part? Lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. <laughs> All right, I think that'll be good. Let's give this a save. So let's take this all the way back here. There we go. Plug that in. Inside Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons? Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have, like, a deck gain of, like, zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. Insides. <laughs> All right, export audio. Export audio, main two. And then, yes, export. There we go. Uh, file, save again, just to make sure. Save project, save, and then exit out of this. And bring this back over to here. There we go. I did send that out, didn't I? Yeah.
do 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 for the raid there we go bum 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 I guess that'll probably be a better way. I keep thanking, uh, forgetting to thank people for the raid while on Twitter. And uh, I think that's probably going to be the easier way to do that is to have Twitter open and just do that uh, immediately when that when that comes on up. Why is the floor weird? I just realized that the floor is weird. Uh-oh. <laughs> the floor is weird. Uh, we need to change this up to uh that, and then we need to do a grab y, and then point five. Re no, that's no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, grab x. Point five. There we go. Okay. Um, grab X negative one. There we go. Much better. Now those tiles aren't just kind of like a half on, half off. Half on, half off. <laughs> half on, half off. All right. Well, that's a problem down there, but that's that's not that isn't gonna be too much of a problem much more longer okay we're just gonna shove that up there there we go much better what what are you doing oh okay yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. you have overlap but i don't care <laughs> you have overlap but i don't care uh okay let's go ahead and put in the audio here Um, do, 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 sounds, voice acting, puka, steampunk part store, part five, display waveform, there we go. Um, it's easier if we, like, just showed you, it's right across the street. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory? <laughs> no, but do you remember their slogan, doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. <The> <laughs> oh, gosh. Chicken flesh. There, there's the living uh, block voxel. Living block voxel. Living block voxel. Oh, what, what, are you, what are you doing, Remy? For sakes. Alrighty, so. I need to get these guys to start walking and across the street is what I need to do. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Um, I don't have everything animated up to this point either. So... Let's let's go ahead and start working on like a horse walk because we're gonna need to be working on that. Um, let's see if we can get some reference because working with quadrupedal uh, animation is definitely difficult. So let's do horse walk animation uh animation walk cycles here we go do 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 why yes i never wanted this thank you very much skip Oh. In 
interesting. Okay. 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 Here we go. So up, down, up, down. Up, down. Okay. So while one is one is stepping, uh, doing a pass. Okay. Contact. Okay. Yeah. 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 That that definitely helps. Okay. All right, we'll start there. We'll start there and see what we can do. Let's go ahead. See if we like just showed you. It's right across the street. Okay, let's go ahead and get these guys in a a uh, fixed state for their normal animations here. So we're gonna put basically just a a lock rock scale on everything. Lock, rock, scale. There we go. And then we're going to want to do the same with uh, this one over here. We're going to want to do a lock, rock, scale there too. And then we're going to want to do the same with Puka. Um, actually, we're going to want to do Puka a little bit. Part of the reason... No need to worry about randomly summoning fell spirits. Right, this terrible sin. Delicious. Ha <laughs> ha! Big factory? No, but, um, it's easier if we, like, just showed you. It's right across the street. Inside. All right, now here, I think, is probably where I'm going to... Whoop, nope. Uh, I want Puka body animation. Here we go. Now we'll do a lock rock scale on that. There we go. Now we want to... Uh, I already have a walk animation for him. We'll work on him in a bit. The horses are definitely the ones we're going to have to work on for right now. So let's go ahead and see about getting you a walk animation. Uh, horse idle... Um, let's pull this guy down, bring back the repeat, because we're going to be stationary. And then we're not want to go nothing, uh, nothing. And then we want to do a nothing there too. Okay. So we're back with normal horse. Uh... And then, how does the tail move? Okay, the tail doesn't matter. Okay, the tail doesn't matter because it's not moving at all. So we can we can keep the tail at least. Uh, so repeat. Yeah, that can that can stay. Chicken flesh, the vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Okay, good, 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 good. All right, let's go ahead and give this a quick save, and then we want to start. Uh, doing something. How do I want to start off this animation? Because normally um, I start off in either an up clear. or down, but I kind of have to do both with uh, both of them, which is... Mm. Uh, actually, let's take a break really quick, guys. Let's go to Puppy Potty Break. And Plinko should work this time. I found out what the problem was. It was because I was changing from uh, older versions to newer versions. I had to replace the command uh, nodes for this thing. So now Plinko should work. So there we go. At least mass fire work. <laughs> I got to go to the bathroom. I'll see you a bit in a bit.
There we go. All right, back. I have a turn. Got myself some chips too. Matter of fact, I'm gonna close this guy right here. Oh, for the sakes. There we go. Close that guy so I can put down my bag of chips. Nom 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 nom. nom. All right, back to here. Wow. Puppies are nice and curled up. Give the puppies a little bit of a treat. Let's go pop with There you are. Remember, guys, you got some water over here, too. Yeah. You got some water over there. Just in case you guys get thirsty. Alright. We need to make a horse walk. How are we going to do that? So I guess we need to start off with at least one of the sections moving downward. So I think what I need to do, I'm going to try something out. Let's go ahead and start off with... Um, all of them. Lock, rock, scale push this down and then we want to do a here tab we want to do another lock rock scale but i want this one to reset so okay so we have that now we want to reset and grab give it a lock rock scale again and then then get rid of that. Okay. So now we have a horse that we can walk with. Radio. You can walk a horse uh, to Tango's house, but you can't make it drink, huh? Uh, Alright. I want... So horse does horse does dun 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 is the um is the uh, path that we go. So we want the horse's body to be up for this section. I'm gonna try and do something here. Up for this section, and and then we, if we move down the hip, okay, that doesn't really quite work. All right, let's not do it that way then. Let's take everything and at least move it down a bit. Okay? So we're going to move it down to here at least. And... All right, we want it to move down further to here. And move it up here. 
Yeah, okay, so we want these to move up. Like that. And then... The head... The head goes down. I'm gonna do it with just the... The neck bones first, neck bones first, and then, and then the head looks up. Okay. These ones move apart. If I'm reading this correctly, these ones move apart and then these ones stay together. Uh, which, how does that work? Okay, so those ones go apart. Okay, so the left one behind, this one, this one is, is the one that's pushing. So this is the one that's pushing, and then this one is the one that's lifted. This is the one that's lifted. Okay, so the back two make contact, the front two do not. So it needs to go doot, doot. That's what I need to do. I needed to do a doot doot, and then... Let's zoom in on here for a minute. Right like that, okay. So doot doot, and then these guys switch, but it's still gonna be the same type of body position. Uh, okay, let's do a grab on this guy and then bring this one up. Something like that. And then these two switch from here to there. And then from there to here. Alrighty. I think what I need to do also is move these guys out. And then move these guys out as well. That's going to be better. Okay. And let's do the same thing with these. Move these ones out. Move these ones out. Those are going to need to go out. Good. Uh, fruity umbrella drinks. No need for that. Huh? Hmm. Alrighty. Now we have at least from here to there. Here to there, yes. And then we need to do a another one like that. Um, gosh, why does a quadruped have to be so complicated in order to walk? Alright. I'm going to go a little bit like this, rotate a little, so that way we have a little bit of a randomosity to the walk a little bit. There we go. Okay. Now I'm going to want this one to be here too. Because we're going to be repeating it in a loop. But. This is the difficult part. Is it just going to be. The reverse for this section here. So what I need is for both of these to be on the ground. The front two. Um. Let's see here. You are going to be back. You're going to be back a bit, and you are going to be forward a bit. Okay. You... You are going to be down. That's correct. You are going to be do a lock rock scale there, just to make sure you stay down. And then you have an up. Okay. No. Okay, and now we need to do the reverse for that. 
these two this one has a down this one has a down and then this one has a up okay and then both of these have a down and the Okay, this one is forward, and then this one is backwards. Okay, good. Give it a save really quickly. No, but the All right, good. Good, good. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and do a repeat on this guy, just to make sure that we're getting somewhere. No, but do you, do you remember right, this good. Now we need to do the reverse of the up and down, which is the front needs to be down and the back needs to be up. So we bring this end up to there and we bring this end down. Radio, and then these two can... Move forward a bit until the front one touches down at least. <coughs> Whoa. And now the front of the horse needs to move up. And then the horse's face needs to come down. Yes. We will do a bit of randomosity with all of these bones here. Okay. And then we drag this over to here. And this should give us something of a walk. No, but do you remember their slogan? Kind of. Hmm. All right. Let's take a look at this. No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first. Uh, let's get rid of the outside. Outside area, so that way we can see this in a better, smoother lighting. No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first. Yeah, that seems fine. That seems fair. Let's go ahead and do this. I think what would be best is if... This section here were to be offset by a couple. Or actually, just one frame. Let's do one frame each for these. And then let's do a couple frames for these guys here. Okay, let's do three frames. And then these, let's do this, this, and this. Let's take all of this and offset that by one frame. Offset that one by one frame, okay. No, but do you remember their slogan? No, but do you remember their slogan? Does it that feels better. It feels better. What happens when we slow it down? Actually, I'm going to need to take... No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first. They're both delicious. <laughs> All right. Uh, chicken flesh. <laughs> chicken flesh. All righty. We want all of that. And we want to duplicate this and move it on over. Yes, I think. Okay. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Yeah, that seems about right. No, but do you remember this? Okay. Let's go ahead and try playback of increasing the... S <clears throat> slowing down the time, I'm sorry. No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. Ha 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 ha. Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons. 
Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. <laughs> we not but broke robots. That's right, I need to send this the lines off to um Zach. Alrighty. We need Where'd it go? Oh, did I close the window? No, no, I didn't close the window. There were things right here. But rogue, rogue robots. Robots. Copy. Good, 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 good. All right, now I can send that off. Here is the uh, two lines. Here is the two lines. There we go. Much better. Okay. No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The Absolute delight. <laughs> Chicken flesh. Okay. So I think that's a pretty good uh, animation for sheer. Let's go ahead. Whoop, no, no. I want to copy that. We're going to copy that and then we're going to bring it into this horse here, too. I'm going to want to. I want to bring on in. Let's do a lock rock scale and everything. That is. And then we want to do a forward one paste on in items. Uh push items down. Go to tab. Get rid of these guys. Manual frame cycles. Yes. And then we want to bring this back a bit here. There we go. Then we duplicate this, put it there, duplicate this, put it over here. And that should make it a uh, cycle a little bit better. Okay, let's bring up the speed back, speed playback and the repeat. Powers. Is that why you like Much better. Okay. Now we have a walk animation for the horses. Good. Why did the music stop? You should not stop. And you're playing the last song again. Uh, let's not do that. Thank you very much. All right. So now we can start getting the hard task of actually starting up the walk. 
Once you start up and stop the walk, that's the hard part. Once you get them moving, it's a little bit easier. Hmm. <laughs> Pick being around me. It's part of the reason. No need to worry about randomly summoning fell spirits up until now. Okay. So, how can I help you right this terrible sin that you have committed? Well, like, um, it's easier if we, like, just showed you. It's right across the street. Inside. I'm gonna need the camera to start moving around this time. Um, let's actually. Sure, here you go. Don't give. Hmm. Let's get rid of that. Let's bring this on in to here. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory. <laughs> that moves a little too quickly. Let's go ahead and fix that up. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory. No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. Ha 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 ha. Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. But Alright, and then that's gonna be pardon me right there. Right about here. Both delicious. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Okay, and we're gonna need to stretch out this section here. All right, so inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. Ha 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 Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons? Mm. Pardons. Okay, so this actually needs to move a little faster. Not too much. And then these ones can move on in here. Uh, pardons, does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have, like, a deck gain of, like, zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. All right, there we go, and then we need to scale that out for sure. Wrong. Pardons, does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have, like, a deck gain of, like, zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. Perfect. That's going to be the right timing. Love that. So now we need to go from here. Street. Inside Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The there we go. Good. So now we need to get from here. Inside Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? Uh, we need to start putting in, like, a, uh, get ridding, getting rid of the idle here. Idle animation. There we 
go. We want repeat and pull that back. Hold, and then we want to do a, actually, let's do a, a repeat up to here. And I want to grab uh, this pose, copy pose, and bring down the repeat to here. Repeat to there, and then we're going to do a, um... So you're going to do a lock rock scale on that and then push it down. Okay. Alrighty. And then we need to go from here. Inside Stephanie's chicken. And we want to do a rotate and grab. Like here. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory? No. All right. Seems pretty good. Give it a save. And then we want to bring in walk animation. Where is walk? Walk. I'm gonna walk. There it is. Boom, boom, boom. I'm gonna bring this on up to here. Phantoms! Welcome on in, everybody. How y'all doing? Good to see you. Hello. Murder of Phantoms appears in the sky. We got a specific raid video for you guys, don't we? Bum, 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 bum. Pause that music and bring it on the raid. <laughs> It's past your bedtime. It's past your bedtime. It's past Come on in. Ah, <laughs> uh, we are in fact actually working with those pretty horses right now for this animation. <laughs> Things have gotten weird. Side step. <laughs> Things have gotten very weird. We're uh, actually trying to get uh, the these uh, these people across the. Across the area, so we're doing like a um, a repeating walk animation that we can do, so that we can get everybody um, a across the way. So we're gonna be moving them from here. Whoop! Nope. Undo that. Through here and just across the street. That's all we're trying to do while having a conversation, nonetheless. Ah, uh, raid and run, but we're lurking. All right, cool, cool. If anybody wants to let me know what was uh, happening on Phantom Lin's stream today, let me know. Love to hear what was going on. Um, uh, <clears throat> so <clears throat> inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The bacon lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons? Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have, like, a deck gain of, like, zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. <laughs> and that's what we're animating right now. <laughs> uh, all right. It's funny to talk because it, it's only the death of robots. Robots. 
<laughs> All right, I need to undo the hide on the Please walk. And we need to we need to move you to about right here. And this needs to be not replace, but combine. Okay. And this needs to be not hold, but nothing. And you need to be... Uh, Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory. All right. We need to... Reduce the playback on that. Uh, repeat. Woo! Hello. Mm, that's not going to go well now, is it? Okay, let's not do that then. Let's do a blend out. Uh, blend out. There we go. That'll probably be enough. Street. Inside Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory. <laughs> Stephanie's Chicken... All right, now we just need to push back, I think, from here. So, let's go ahead and take you, and let's push back a little bit and turn this direction. I think that will be okay. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg. Yeah, that does okay. Inside Stephanie. Now we just need to manipulate these keyframes right about here. Yeah, right here. Okay. Let's fix these guys. Mm, grab Y. There we go. Uh, you. Uh, combine. New. Uh, hold. There we go. Much better. Uh, hold. Nothing. There we go. Do that, walk, uh, hold, no, uh, nothing. Do, do, why is it still leaning forward a bit? Alrighty. Let's go to you and bring you back a little bit then. Because we just want to push off from the desk. That's really all we want to do. Save. Phantoms was working on his house. He is taking all the time to get the texturing just right. Good, good. It's always it's always worth it to make sure that something uh, looks proper. Because, uh, it's hard to go back in Minecraft. There's no undo. Well, I mean, there's an undo, but it takes forever to complete. Mm. All right. Inside Stephanie's... Um, I think I want this hand to hold on to the desk a little bit longer inside stephanie's mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Look at that inside Maybe we could be pointing off in that direction. And then I think maybe the head should be swiveled in this direction. As though we were talking to the horses off to this side. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg. Woo! Let's go ahead and keep... Keep this. Yeah, we're going to need to keep that. Very much so. Okay. Because that's going to lead us where we need to go. Uh, we're going to want to move. 
in terms of the main bone, we're going to want to move... We're going to want to move this direction. Okay. That entire time, I'm going to want you to go all the way over to here. Right about there. About right there. Chicken and egg factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter. Okay, good. That seems fine. Let's go ahead and repeat this a lot until the end of this portion of the animation. Repeat, repeat, repeat. Chicken and egg factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first. They're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. <laughs> Let's slow down the walk here a bit. Because we can actually, you know, always uh, pick up and, and stop the walk when we want to. Minnie's Chicken and Egg Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. But Alrighty. We're gonna want to be about whoa nope. We're gonna want to be Minnie's ch uh, chicken flesh. The vacant you have spared just looked at me wrong. Alright, we're gonna want to be here when we hear that. We're gonna wanna be here, facing this direction. And through going through the door uh and then we can keep that there we're gonna want to be about right here with that and then then we're gonna want to turn a bit and face this direction There we go. Something like that. Across the street. Inside Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? No. I think maybe the best idea for this section is going to be putting these guys onto a linear walkway rather than a Bezier. Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first. They're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The Okay, this speed seems fine right here. And this seems a little too slow, so let's go ahead and do this. Oh, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. Ha 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 But do you remember their slogan? Does okay, and then we want to make sure our character is facing... More a little bit that No, way. but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter. Inside Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first. They're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardon. Yep, perfect. That's perfect timing right there. That's where we want it. Spider, did that come up? I gotta know if that spider came up. Spider... It did. Ah, okay, good. It did. Had to make sure. Sometimes things don't work. Just gotta make sure. Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Uh, 
Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have... This is gonna need to be, need to be in here. Does you have spare coin? Hmm. All right, let's figure out how exactly far we need to walk with this. Um, because I'm pretty sure I don't have that correct. Let's go with the extra buildings up. There we go. And we need to go to about here. Okay. We actually need to go right here. Gardens, does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have, like, a deck gain of, like, zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to have to figure this out, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to. Um, we're going to want to change the walk from one to another here. The vacant lot where fail. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Okay, here we go. Let's go ahead and kill this repeat to about right here okay so we want an eight repeat and then we want to duplicate this guy and bring him right over to here and here i think we're gonna have to slow down even further the walk Pardons, does you have spare? Even further. Even further. Slow it down. Pardon me wrong. Pardons, does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have, like, a deck gain of, like, zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. Why not? There we go. <clears throat> Give it a save. Uh, now we need to get the horses to move across the way. Get them into at least some sort of frame so that way we know where they are. Uh, so we're going to want to have them... Pretty horses, we're going to call this one walk, horse walk, horse walk, walk one, and we're going to call the other one horse walk two, horse walk two, okay, give it a save. Now we need to get the horses moving. Enjoy. Uh. An egg factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? I think what I want to do with them is kind of move them around a little bit before the camera reaches them and kind of like have them side by side. Uh, let's go ahead and do a... Showed you? It's right across the street. Inside... Alright, and then this horse walk needs to be right there. There. And then the other horse walk needs to be somewhat similar. Repeat. Okay, bring down the repeat a bit. Bye. 
about there. Okay, and then we need to do a, another body animation for these guys. Um, let's go ahead and do a lock rock scale. Yes, on all these lock rock scale. Yes, bring it down, bring it down. Good. go tab perfect let's do a rotate and grab on all of those <clears throat> and then this is going to be a combine yes and then this one is going to be a combine as well and combine combine Okay, now we just need to take these two sections, and these chicken and egg. We just need to move these guys around a bit, so that way we can get them to start walking out the door. Whoop. Go. Much better, much, 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 much better. So much better. Yay. So much better. Now these guys will probably walk rather well. Uh, let's go ahead and offset this animation a little bit too. Yeah, there we go. It's Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? That's All right, we're going to do the same thing with Puka on these guys. And I'm going to want to take the points and move them to the end location. Where that comes from. Pause right there. Wait. I am questioning where my stock comes from. Okay, and then we want to do a... Move the horses to that side. That's what we want to do. Whoop. No wonder I don't see it. Ah, that's why. Okay. Spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. Okay, and then we want the horses over here, and one on one side, and one on the other. Do 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 do, and then. I want to rotate you this way. I want to rotate you this way. Move you on over. And we'll move you on over. There we go. You are going to be linear. Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. Ha 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 ha. Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. All right. I'm thinking that I'm going to want the horse walk to actually happen a little bit late earlier, uh, later. Um, yeah, right about here is going to be good. This chicken and egg factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first. They're this 
chicken and egg factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> chicken. Chicken. Doesn't matter which came first. That tells me something there. First, they're both delicious. Which came first? They're both delicious. Thing, and then we want to blend in. Blend in. Came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons? Does you have spare coin? Mm, you are going to have to hold back as well as one horse goes through uh, at a time. Let's go ahead and take your walking speed and let's move you back a little bit here. Like let's Let's start you off a little bit late. To there and then we can move you on over to here there we, go. we not but broke robots whoops We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have, like, a deck gain of, like, zero souls, and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. Hey, good. Whoa! Difficult. Difficult, 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 difficult. Oof. I might have the robots run a little bit earlier. Because once they see them, they're going to want to run. So they'll probably get out their lines about the robots. And then the horses will say something. And then they'll say something in the background. Where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons? Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. <laughs> oh, I'm not looking forward to this portion of the animation. Oh, woof, woof. I need to basically give them character 
and walk around. Oh. This is a difficult portion of the animation. Super difficult. Alright, let's get through it though. We can do it. We can do it! Daphne's Chicken and Egg Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter what... Which came first? Why are the eyes wrong? The eyes are wrong. That's not right. The eyes are definitely wrong. I think it's just because I set one of these to a neutral, maybe? Yeah, it's probably that. Let's go ahead and uh, add in a, a facial expression into this section here. We're gonna want this one, that group. Uh. Wow! <laughs> Scare me to death. What are you doing? Wiggly, welcome on in, yo. Oh, what is today? That's right, I forgot. I want to check up what it is today. What it is today. Let's see your stream resources. National today. Today is Letter to an Elder Day. Let's see here. What else is on February 26th? Mm, today. Today also has National Pistachio Day. Uh, Carnival Day. For Pete's sake, Day. For Pete's sake. National Tongue Twister Contest Day. National Tongue Twister Contest Day. Weird. She sells she sells by the seashore. That type of thing. Let's go ahead and add that expression into this guy here. you it's right across the street inside stephanie's chicken and egg factory <laughs> just showed you it's right across the street inside stephanie's chicken and egg factory <laughs> no. mm -hmm. i thought you would be what i want you to be mm. Told you, it's right across the street. There we go. There we go. Inside Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? Nope. Why are you degrading? Why, 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 why you degrade? Does Walk have in it something in it that I should know about? No. Nope, walk doesn't have anything in it. Little no hands. Mm -hmm. No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. Inside Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. Ha 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 Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those... Alright, there we go. There's at least something on his face. Because that, that, those eyes weren't correct. Ooh, uh... 
Mmm, cold pizza for breakfast. Woot! Which, to be honest, is one of the best days. True, true. I'm gonna have myself some warm pizza uh, after stream today. Yep, I'm gonna do a warm pizza after stream. Full show. Full show! Inside Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? All right, we need... We need you to be... Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. But broke robots. Oh, robots. Oh. Um, bum, ba -da -bum. No. Not but broke robots. Right over here. We're gonna move the hand into some sort of like purse pocket, I guess. So let's go ahead. Purse pocket? Purse pocket? Oh. Yeah, yeah, sure. Getting it done. Don't give them like any. Any money, any puka. Any money, puka. There we go. Sugar Star, hey, how's it going, yo? Good to see ya. Oh my gosh, I've been loving your, um, your illustrations for, um, Season 10 and The Mailman. 
the mailman, the mailman, um, they are looking absolutely adorable. I absolutely love them. Yeah, no, there I go. I need to get myself some more caffeine. Got myself a caffeine packet. Got a nice flavor packet for the Ahakwo. So that way it's a lot less sugar. Heck of a lot more caffeine and very much hydrating. Very much hydrating. Less sugar means more water. And that's what I need. I need more water. Mm-hmm. Bum, 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 bum. Fan art in this season while well, I can't. I know what you mean. I know exactly what you mean. I mean, that's why we're... <laughs> I'm trying to get moving on Tango's, uh, Tango's house animation. I want this animation done before the end of the season. <laughs> or if he loses interest in steampunk. I've got to get that done, too. Oh, like I need to get eat done. Why not? Here you go. Don't give them like any money. So yeah, yeah, sure. Here you go. Don't. So yeah, yeah, sure. Sure, here you. Go. Sure, here you go. Don't give them, them like any money, Puka. Why? Sure, here you go. Don't give them like any money. Hey, Puka. Uh, Why? Why not? Well, hope it's don't. Save really quickly. Why not? Robots don't have soul. Robots don't have soul. Don't have soul. Uh oh. What did I do? Robots don't have soul. Robots don't have. Robots don't have. Hmm. Hmm. The double deuce is going on. Robots don't have soul. Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have like a 
a deck gain of like zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare. Spare part. I suddenly am questioning. questioning where my stock comes from. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. All done. No more animation ever. Ugh. Good galley. Good galley. Okay. Uh, let's meet Blender here so that way you guys don't hear this. They're both the That's not muting Blender. I do want to get that camera a little bit better here because we're going to have to get the guy capturing very little of the feet because I'm going to have to get them to step down because there's a there's a step here across the street and I don't want that. I don't want to uh, show them stepping down just other than their bodies moving downward. Extra buildings. Okay, when do we need to bring in that? Let's go ahead and put the focal length here. There we go. Okay, we're going to have to add this into the walk before I move the camera, aren't I? We're gonna have to do very little in terms of uh, in terms of uh, animating the step down. Okay, I'm gonna want it to step down to here, to here. Yep, and then. <laughs> there we go, something like that. Uh.
go. There it goes. Good, good, good. Mob Slayer! How's it going? Good to see you. Oh, gotta step down. Then back up. Oh, and then the horses are gonna be absolute travesty on this portion, too. Portion? This portion? Yeah, this portion. Hmm. Bum, 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 bum. These need to change their pace up a little bit, too. I think the walk needs to uh, somehow slow down. Yeah, that, that's way too fast. They need to slow down their pace a lot. Oh, yeah, that's one thing I need to do. I forgot about that. Whoops. So, these need to have specific keyframes that are set for linear while walking. So... Okay, so... What needs to happen? This one needs to be set to linear. Here. That needs to be set to linear. This one needs to be set to linear. This one also needs to be linear. Um, let's see here. We're 
right about here. Let's do a linear. Hey, Jen, how's it going? <coughs> Animating the next section. Did some uh, voice acting, if you want to hear it. Let me know if you can actually hear things at the moment, or if you're just getting things set up. I kind of muted everything. Kind of muted everything because we're kind of gonna just getting a real annoying section here where I have to go back and forth. Yes, please. Need a moment of calm. Okay. All right. So the scenario is that um, the horses now tell that tell Puka that what they need help with is across the street. All right. So there. This is the walk from inside the steampunk parts store to across the street to a vacant lot. Inside Stephanie's. Oh wait, wait. Just showed you. It's easier if we like. Just showed you. It's right across the street. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. Ha 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 Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons? Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have, like, a deck gain of, like, zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. <laughs> robots. No, not robots. Robots. We not but broke robots. We're on the poor side, and we've got to get spare parts for me leg. As you can see, it's no longer copper leg. It is a wooden leg. Yar. Yes. Robots. <laughs> Not but, not but poor robots. <laughs> Alright. And now we're doing the very, 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 very difficult task. Of animating and walking. And also walking downstairs. I didn't just give myself, no, not just a walk across a flat plane, but no, I had to give myself a little bit of a stair step, too. So they have to walk across here while talking, down this step, and then back up a step again, until they face this direction. I'm so cool like that, right? Just toss some, toss some very difficult animation at me, why don't I? <laughs> some very difficult animation. Should one robot, robot uh, have a redstone torch for uh, for a limb? That's a darn good idea. Darn good idea. I like it. Let me put down that note. That's a darn good idea. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. We want Tango's house. Uh... One robot has a redstone torch for a limb, possibly two. <laughs> one of the limbs is pointing in, one of the limbs is pointing out. I don't know, something like that. <laughs> uh... Looks good so far, just, uh, I'm talking to a mechanic. Just talking to a mechanic! Lever for an antenna? I wasn't thinking of having them have antennas, though. Yeah. <laughs> Although, compared to Futurama rules, both of them are 
male robots, so they should uh, have antennas. <laughs> right? Futurama. And first, they're both delicious. Ha 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 ha. Chicken flesh. The vacant lot. Oh yeah, that's right. I need to keep adding these to like uh all right, so how does how do these go now? Let me take a look at these. First, they're both delicious. Okay. <laughs> okay, they're still sliding, but they're a little bit better now, I think. Let's go ahead and make sure that these have some sort of um, linear movement to them, too. And I'm going to have to fix the other ones, too, because I accidentally forgot about that. All right. So you. This one lifts up. This one is put down, so this one needs a linear movement. And then this one needs a linear movement, and then that one should be good for that one. And then this one has linear movement on these two. There we go. Alrighty, now I need to fix the other one too. Give this a save. Because these are going to need a little bit of fixing, too. Uh, this one needs to be linear, and then this one needs to be linear. Yes. And then this one. Yep, this one is going to need to be linear, while these two are linear. And that should help out on that. These two are probably going to be linear, right? That one and this one. Which came first? They're both delicious. <laughs> much better, much better, much better. Okay, so now we need to... Now that we have those moving properly across the ground, because it's a lot easier to move from linear to linear uh, bone movement, and if the, if the feet move on a linear movement, meaning it just goes from zero to one consistently rather than doing any sort of interpolation between them. Then what I can do is when this guy moves uh, from point A to point B, uh, I can give that uh, a, a linear movement too from point A to point B and the feet should move, uh, should stick onto the floor a little bit better. And now I can, if I set the horse walk, I can now adjust this so that way the feet stop sliding. <laughs> Chicken flesh, the vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons, does you have... Uh, horse walk. Here we go. Base. This is linear. I wonder why. I wonder why. If I do the. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I remember. Now I remember. This playback speed needs to be reduced. Okay. They're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons. Does okay. Now this one needs to move about at the same speed. So let's... Does you have spare coin? We not but broke a robot. First, they're both delicious. <laughs> 
<laughs> Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those m <laughs> Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those, those muffins looked at me wrong. Alright, that's better. That's much, much, much better on the on the hoof movements. Their slogan, doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The vacant and since they're 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 that far away when they start walking, First, they're both delicious. <laughs> and facing towards the camera, there's a little bit of slide, but there's not as much anymore. So that does wonders. All right, so now let's go ahead and see about getting these horses down on the uh, down the stairs. Now that we have that all set up. <laughs> Coin. We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Now we can figure out where these feet lie. Don't give them, like, any money, money Puka. Why? not I'm thinking maybe we angle down the base bone and then we can work from there. It should be a little bit easier to uh, get everything to work properly from there. Why not? Robin. Why not? Robots don't have... Robots don't have Why not? Robots don't have Hmm I'm gonna wanna angle this down a little bit first and then <laughs> Nah Whoa, why have you done that? You terrible machine. You terrible machine. How dare you? Mm, no, you've done it again, Mr. McGill. Uh, why not? Uh, why not? Robots don't... There we go. Don't have... Okay, and then we're going to want to move you forward and bring you down. So this guy is going to move downward and level out. Souls. And, and how would. And then this one's gonna land about there. And then we need to bring it down just a little bit more. And then bring it back up. Woof. Woof! That's a lot of movement. Yeah. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long there we go. That's much better. So, 
what this is going to do is this is going to basically move the move the whole rig properly so that way uh i can adjust uh the feet no uh, adjust the feet and the body to uh where i need it to be and still have the same type of motion rather than rather than uh super customizing the walk cycle you know from point a to point b this way i can just go uh eh, somewhere in the middle of point a and point b start doing something funky lever for uh off to bed all right take care stephanie be safe yo All right. Let's give it a save just to make sure not we're not going to lose anything. Also do a save copy. Save copy. Copy, copy, save, save, copy. Uh, modification date. Backup. Save copy. Make sure we're not going to be losing nothing. All right, I'm gonna want to bring this guy up again. Uh, matter of fact, actually, this guy isn't down far enough. There we go. How would you know? Long story short, we have like a deck gain of like zero souls and And lot Mm, we're going to want this back end still down a bit. Lots of spare parts. Spare part? Lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am Alright, and that should be good. And lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. All right. Well, that was that was irritating. Let's do it again. No, <laughs> oh, good golly. It's a lot. Mm, plug that in. There we go. Oh. Oh. Good lord, how long is this animation at the current? Video editing at current. This animation is only two... It's only th about three minutes long at the, mo at the most right now. And it's probably going to head into like at least six or seven minutes.
It's a really long animation, I have to say. Hmm. All right. Yep. Let's do it again. <laughs> oh, I love torturing myself. It's so fun. <laughs> First, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons. Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have... Robots don't have... Okay. Oh, oh, that's right. I'm not in animation right now. Ah! I'm doing that on the wrong layer. Don't you love it when you're animating on the wrong layer? <laughs> oh, I know how some people feel with drawings. Don't have... Mm. have soul. We're going to start the descent right here. Relatable, yeah. <laughs> oh. 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 And how would you? Balls. And how would you know? You know. And how would you know? Long story short, we have like a That's good. That's good. I like that. Okay. A deck gain of like zero souls and lots of it's a spare parts. Of spare parts. Spare part? Suddenly, I'm questioning where my stuff.
Oh, good golly. Okay, I think I have at least the base animation done. Chicken and Egg Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> okay, so now I think what I can do is I can come in here with the camera animations and get them to be at least a... Uh... Delicious. No, but but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. Ha <laughs> jeez. For some reason, chicken flesh always gets me. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardon. Muffins. Scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons. Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Poop. Pooka. Give them. I'm gonna want to move in a little bit closer. Coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Not. Ro robots. Robots don't have soul. Hot. Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Uh, maybe I should also figure out which one's doing what voice here. Um, I need to open up uh, Destiny and figure this out. I need a uh, left, right, left, right here for sure. Um, I'm wanting to open up main audio too. But do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which... But do you remember their slogan? Pardons. Okay, so this this most likely is going to be the left one. Let's so let's do that. Let's do a little bit left there and a little bit right there, and this should work out just fine. So if we do a file, no no no, no. hold on hold on. Okay. Factory. No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first. They're both delicious. Ha 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 ha. Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons. Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why well, not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have, like, a deck gain of, like, zero souls and lots of spare parts. Okay. So we're going to be going left... Right, left. No, no, no. We're going to be going right, left, right. Okay. 
Uh, after after the spare parts. Oh yeah, yeah, sure. Here you go. Go no, get. Give them like any money. Money, Puka. Like any money, Puka. Any money, Puka. Why not? Why not? Robots don't have souls. Oh, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I think I did that wrong. Um, like any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have like a deck game. So... Yeah, right, left, right. Okay. Stage, stage right, stage, uh... Well, no, 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 hold on. Or I could actually just flip them. Yeah, 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 yeah. I could just flip them. Depending on what I want. Uh... So, in other words... Oh, spare cool. Here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have soul. Okay, so maybe what we want to do is just flip it in audacity. Uh, excuse me. Uh... Uh, we want this to be... Right... And then we want this one to be left. So, to the right, yes, that. To the left, yes, that. And to the right, yes, less that. Okay, good, 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 good. Yeah, they, uh... And then we can do a file, export, audio. And export. Yes, replace it. Alright, and then that should give me, in the audio section here... Inside Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons, does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money. Okay, so here we go. This is what's going to determine the camera. So what I need is give them like any Oh yeah yeah sure here you go. Don't... Let's do a lock rock scale there along with the focal length and then we can change the focal length for Don't this give section. Them like any... Here. Any money puka. Why not? Okay, now I think maybe what I can do with this guy is I should move this guy a little bit off to the side here. We want to move them on the X direction, right? X direction by a little bit, though. And then let's go ahead and do a here. And we want to move grab Y. Oh, no, that's X rotation. Darn it! Uh, we want X location. And then we can go to that. And then we want to do a grab Y. Hmm, not particularly. 
particularly exactly what I'm looking for. Grab Y. Okay, that's forward and backwards. Uh, scale Y. Mm. Bum, There we go. Why not? Robots don't have. <laughs> what I can probably do is I can do a lock rock scale here with this guy. And then I can slowly just bring these guys apart. So if I do a grab Y here. And then grab these guys, do a grab Y, bring them down. Then we can kind of slowly uh, move off to the side here. Grab Y. Slowly move off to the side here too, grab Y. Uh, Why not? Robots don't have souls. Ah, here we go. Now I can definitely see where the camera needs to Robots go. Robots don't have souls. And how how would you know? Long st story short. Kids don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have like a deck gain of like zero souls. And lots of spare parts. And lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am I'm quite... Story short, we have like a deck gain of like zero souls and lots of spare parts. Story short, we have like a deck gain of like zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. from. Questioning where my stock comes from. Questioning where my stock comes from. Hey, good, 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 good. Oh, now what we can do is we can have. There we go. 
I got irritated there for a minute, sorry. <laughs> Let's get this main bone duplicated over here. There we go. We're going to duplicate that until I don't know when. Stock comes from. Uh, there we go. Comes from. Uh, let's see here. You want to kill down the re repeat to about here with a blend out in it. And we want, what is this? Idle animation. I'm gonna want this idle animation. We're gonna want that to unhide, rip, unhide, then go, and blend in. Comes from. There we go, much better. It's nice and smooth transition between those two. Whew. Arctic Fox, oh hey! Sorry, I didn't see you. Message you. Welcome on in, yo. Good to see you. It's been forever. Been forever. Been forever. Been forever. Been forever. Ah. Do 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 do. Bum bum. My stock comes from. Things are going okay. Um, I'm being roped into something by the pretty horses. I don't know what. I have no idea what. I haven't sure... Uh, not sure if you've been around here for this, but um, there's this thing that, uh, that we have now. Take a tour of the stream area. Let's take a tour of it. Just take a step on back and see... Uh, all that's around here. Got my creeper fridge underneath of here. Uh, got blinds. Got my sleeping area. Neon sign that says my name. Because I'm so vain like that. Elevator to go downstairs to the uh, store area. Because I live above there. Uh, I don't know what to put on the shelves yet. I gotta put something on for my adventures around here. And um, got my own generator to power. My own nether portal too. But yeah, this is my, uh, this is my home now. This is my home. Got a nice little home here. Mm -hmm. But we're just animating, eating up in here. Trying to get these uh, guys to animate across the street. And this has been quite, quite the difficult task. Thankfully, though, uh, we're getting somewhere at least. We're getting somewhere. Oh. I'm at that point where it's just like, oh no, I wanna I wanna stop and do something else. And I probably shouldn't. Probably shouldn't. I wanna I wanna keep on moving with this animation because Oh my gosh, it's a lot. It's a lot. Hey, I'm only halfway through the basic animations. The basic. I feel like you're still hiding something from me. We need to give something back. Horse. Not what? good. Oh my god, hey he now. said it. He said don't, it. Don't swear. Those words have power, you know. Especially around people with demonic powers. Is that why you like being around me? It's part of the reason. No need to worry about randomly summoning fell spirits up until now. Okay, so how can I help you right this terrible sin that you have committed? Well, like, um, it's easier if we, like, just showed you. It's right across the street. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory? 
No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those chicken muffins flesh. looked at me wrong. Pardons, does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we had like a deck gain of like zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. All right. I do need to do a little bit of uh, body animation for this section here because... And for Puka as well. Puka has absolutely nothing in terms of of uh, body animation in this section over here. Where is it at? Uh, Puka. Here we go. Oh. I don't want to help with whatever you have to steal. Says the hypocrite that's good at acquiring pre-owned assets. I... Mmm, I do want to bring down the idle, idle animation a little bit. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba, where's the influence on this thing? There's like a animated influence. Here we go. Animated influence. Don't want to help you with him help with whatever you have to steal. Says the hypocrite that's good at acquiring pre-owned assets. I... I don't want to help you with embarrassing anyone. Mm, what happens if we bring this... Whoa! Interesting. Interesting. Why are you no? That's interesting. Okay. Says the hypocrite that's good at acquiring pre-owned assets. I don't... Want to help you with embarrassing anyone. We are not spreading journalistic truth or enhanced truth. I'm not helping you kill someone. We're not helping someone escape their fleshly soul cage. I feel like you're still... Okay. Yeah, it, it, it works, but for some reason... Oh! Oh, okay, I just needed to mouse over it. Because that was weird, yeah, because when I when I Whatever. go from here, here, and it says one right here, and or then... You steal. Says the hypocrite. And then hypocrite you keep on going down. Acquiring pre -owned assets. I don't... And you hit pause here, and it still says one there. And then when I hit pause, then it come, jumps back to what it says. Okay, okay, okay. We're, we're still good. We're still good then. Okay, so what I want to do is actually make this go down even further. There we go. So we'll do that. I don't want to help you with embarrassing anyone. We are not spreading journalistic truth or enhanced truth. I do want to also fiddle with horse idle a little bit here too. So let's do that. Um, I think, uh, horse idle needs to be, oh, mm. uh, nothing. Okay. Factory. Horse armature. Okay. Anything that I can help you steam up your luck? Replace. Nothing. Okay, that has nothing. That has nothing. Okay. And then this should be... Uh... Should I do this with it? Mm. 
Yes, that seems to help. So let's go ahead and hold that over here. So that way I'm going to have to do... Why are you not like that either? Hello. Uh, you are nothing and you are going to have to... Um, you are going to have to have this keyframe duplicated and brought over to here. Okay, and then does this work forward in that you have committed? Well, like, um, it's easier if we... Horse idle? Horse idle is still not repeat. Like, just showed you? It's right across the street. Inside Stephanie's chick chicken and egg factory? <laughs> no, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons? People with the mo- It's right across the street. Inside Stephanie's chicken there we go. Okay, good, 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 good. Now everything's working properly. Everything is working properly. We're good. We're good. Okay, and what about you? You. Do you have... No, you do not. Let's go ahead and do a nothing on you and a nothing on you. And that should be fine. I do want to continue your repeat on this guy, though. Because that horsetail will be fine. Um, Glad to pop in and say hi. Uh, but I'm not far from bedtime and have a newly starting uh, stream friend to visit. Okay. Uh, fox hugs, puka hugs, super hugs, yo. Hopefully, catch you soon. Bye for... And bye for longer. Uh, all, right. all right, take care. Oh, yeah, that's right. We do have a the thingy that we need to toss at you. G-N. Good night. Sleep tight. Sleep tight. Bum, bum. A newly starting stream fight. Hmm, okay. Now I need to go through this and make sure that all the animation's okay because I took off the holding uh, animations for a bunch of these things. Welcome to Puka Steampunk Parts Store. Anything that I can help you steam up your life? Puka, what were you looking at? Ha, huh, nothing. Don't worry about it. What can I help you with? I don't believe you. How about I just take a look at... Whoops. Butterfingers me. <laughs> what do you want? Puka, dear. We have a new career opportunity for you. Best opportunity. And your business. Don't want to miss it. What did you break? Oh, my God. Like, this is why we come to you, sweetie. You get us. Wherever our ventures lead, we know that there's a... witty, butt-scarf-wielding boxo that we can count on. Flattery will get you nowhere. Flattery has gotten us demonic powers combined with murder. No. No? No what? I'm not helping. But we need your help. I don't want to help with whatever you have to steal. Says the hypocrite that's good at acquiring pre-owned assets. I don't want to help you with embarrassing anyone. We are not spreading journalistic truth or enhanced truth. I'm not helping you kill someone. We're not helping someone escape their fleshly soul cage. I feel like you're still hiding something from me. We need to give something back. Horse shit. Not what? good. Oh my god, hey he now. said it. He said Don't. it. Don't swear. Those words have power, you know. Especially around people with demonic powers. Is that why you like being around me? It's part of the reason. No need to worry about randomly summoning fell spirits up until now. Okay. So, 
how can I help you right this terrible sin that you have committed? Well, like, um, it's easier if we, like, just showed you. It's right across the street. Inside Stephanie's chicken and egg factory? No, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. Ha 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 Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons? Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have, like, a deck gain of, like, zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. Aha! Uh -huh. There it is. I knew something was gonna break. Knew something was going to break, and this one is going to break too. Yep, there it goes. All right, we're going to have to grab you, if I'm correct. And let's go ahead and grab you as well. Because after doing that, I was pretty sure something was going to break, and I didn't knew it. So we want both base bones. Okay, we want both base bones, and we want those to duplicate up until something like there. And then duplicate and move on to something up to, to there, something like there. There we go. And that should help us get to where we need to be. Good. Good, 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 good. Give it a save. stock comes from Alrighty. uh horse walk needs to uh slow down so let's see here when we need to actually bring this horse walk to a uh to a halt here heart i suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from yeah right here okay we're going to stop the repeat like right about there and then we want to do a blend out I'm questioning where my stock comes from okay good and then you you need to have a little bit more walkies up until there and then we need to bring down that repeat to about that point close and batteries going off the hook Ooh, that's getting warm gotta unplug that gotta unplug that Ooh, do 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 blend out there we go whoop okay uh uh, we're going to want a little bit more repeat, not too much. That's better, okay. That's perfect, I like that, okay. And then, what about Tom's you? From. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good stop there too. Okay, good, 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 good. Getting things done, making stuff look pretty. Gonna do another backup save. Save a copy just to make sure that we're not gonna lose anything. Save a copy. Backup. Mm, backup. Whatever you have to steal. Says the hypocrite that's good at acquiring pre owned assets. I don't. It 
I don't want to help you with embarrassing anyone. We are I don't want to help you with embarrassing anyone. We are not spreading journalistic truth or enhanced truth. I'm not helping you kill. Put this hand on the hip. There we go. I'm not helping you kill someone. I'm not helping. I'm not helping. I'm not helping. I'm not helping. I'm not helping you. I'm not helping you kill. I'm going to lean and puff out my chest a little bit. I'm not helping you kill. I'm not helping you kill some. I'm not helping you kill some. I'm not helping you kill. I'm not helping you kill someone. We're not, not helping someone escape their fleshly soul cage. I feel like I need that arm cross again and I can just grab it. Let's see if we can just grab that. I think I can just grab this and adjust it a little bit and it should be fine. I I feel like you're still hiding something from from me. Bum bum bum. Bum, 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 bum. These kind of need to be moved back a little bit. Let's rotate these guys. This one forward and then this one backwards. And then this one forwards a bit. Uh, this needs to go out this way, and then this one needs to go out this way. So, Cage, I feel like you're st still hiding something. Something from me. So, Cage, I feel like you're still hiding something from me. We need to move it to here and then lock rock scale because we're going to hold this pose 
for the next section until we summon the fell spirit accidentally. Me and my foul mouth. What was I thinking? Swearing. Such a terrible person. Something from me. We need to give something back. Horse. Not what? good. Yeah. Not what? good. Rotate. Mm. I want to do a grab on that. Look back and up. Actually, let's get down. And then let's get our feet out. Do a grab on that, and then want to look a little bit panicked as we kind of look upwards and see what our words have wrought us. What our words have wrought us. Not good. Oh my god. Not good. What? Oh my. Dude. Not good. Oh my. Oh my god. Hey he said it. Down. Rotate back. Feels like we're doing good so far. He said it. Don't swear. He said Don't. it. Don't swear. Those words have power, you know. Especially around people with demonic powers. Where? Those words have power, you know. Especially around people with demonic powers. Is that why you like... Powers. Is Is that why you like being around me? It's part of the reason. No need to worry about randomly summoning fell spirits up until now. Okay. There we go. Very good. Oh, Mama Shay! How you doing, y'all? Good to see you. Wow. Super good to see you. Manful Wevel. Manful Wevel. Welcome back on in. We just working on some pretty horse animation. Some pretty horse animation. Is that why you like being around me? It's part of the reason. No need to worry about randomly summoning fell spirits up until now. I see you too. Haven't caught a stream in a while. All right. Well, glad you're here at least. 
I'll change things up a bit. Change things up a bit. Got uh, got ourselves our our own uh, little studio. Uh, got our own little studio. Oh, I can't do that. Oh no, I can't do that. I can't press the button. I need to press the button. I need to press the button. Uh, room overview. Is this what that is? No, hold on, hold on. Uh, check out the area. Ah, okay, here we go. This I think is this is the one. Where you go from here to there. There we go. Horse animation inspired by B Dubs. <laughs> inspired by Tango. We're gonna be working on uh we're working on something called uh, Tango's House. We're on Tango's House. The uh, it's gonna be part five of our steampunk parts store animation. Part five. Because right here, our studio is actually above the store. Because, uh, like, a couple floors down is our little store area. So we are working on that little animation down there. Right down a couple levels. It's, uh, right now, I think we're at, like, uh, three minutes in terms of uh, how long the animation is. And I'm not even halfway done. Not even halfway done with the with the audio. The audio is, like, this long <laughs> the audio is this long and i still is still uh still need to um bring it down a bit all right sander puka D, D just added vulpin uh fox people to the playable races woot woot <laughs> adding fox people to the race to the race <laughs> Uh, 25 months. We got to give you a mass hug, yo. Mass hug at Darth. Hugs to you, yo. Do, 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 do. And one of those regular hugs. Cause, just because I like the animation. Just because I like the animation. Yeah. Hug. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Part store. Anything that I can help you steam up your la? Puka, what were you looking at? Ha, nothing. Don't worry about it. What can I help you with? I don't believe you. How about I just take a look at? Whoops! Butterfingers me. <laughs> what do you want? Puka dear. We have a new career opportunity for you, best opportunity, and your business. Don't want to miss it. What did you break? Oh my god. Like, this is why we come to you, sweetie. You get us. Wherever our ventures lead, we know that there's a witty butt scarf wielding fox though that we can count on. Flattery will get you nowhere. Flattery, Flattery has, has gotten, gotten us demonic, demonic powers, powers combined with murder. No. <laughs> no? No what? I'm not helping. But we need your help. I don't want to help with whatever you have to steal. Says the hypocrite that's good at acquiring pre-owned assets. I don't want to help you with embarrassing anyone. We are not spreading journalistic truth or enhanced truth. I'm not helping you kill someone. We are not helping someone escape their fleshly soul cage. I feel like you're still hiding something from me. We need to give something back. Poor sh**. Not what? good. Oh my god, hey he now. said it. He said it. Alright, I need to give them a bit of animation for this. Although I don't have actually what a fell spirit is going to look like when it reaches through the portal. Uh, maybe I should just get some sort of, like, face that kind of, like, opens up or something like that. Um, how do I want this fell spirit to look? Because I'm going to need them to react to it. And I'm gonna need them to look at it when it when it pops up. So I, I think I gotta actually get this fell spirit to kind of like. So what I'm cur my first thought of this is for some sort of like um, some sort of like hand that reaches through a a ripped portal in the mid air or something like that. That's my first thought. But I don't know. 
I don't know what I want to do with it. Uh... What if... What if we look at some of the models that we have? And see if, uh, see if we can use something. So let's take a look at our models. We can go ahead and grab... Uh, Puka Actors. Let's grab Puka Actors and see what they do. They are horses. Wouldn't uh, it be logical to uh, rear back? Yes. Yes, it would be logical. But I need to put it. I need to put the, the portal somewhere. And I'm not sure what I want the portal to look like. Like, in my head, it's just like some sort of tear in space. But... What do I want it to look like, really? What do I really want it to look like? I don't know. It's going to be good if I just take a look at uh, all the models. I know that we have a horse. We don't have any slimes. We have a... Uh, what do we have? Um, we've got all sorts of regular humanoid models. Uh, do, 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 do. We've got a bear. We have an unrigged sniffer. We don't have a sniffer that's rigged. We just have the shape of a sniffer. We have <laughs> Muscle Man Scar. We have Muscle Man Scar up here. Um, we have another horse, which would be kind of a uh, meta. Uh, goat. We could do some sort of goat. That would make sense, kind of. Some sort of fell spirit that's kind of like a discolored goat thing. Uh, llama would be hilarious. Uh, I don't really have a properly rigged camel. Ooh, a villager would be funny, too. We have a lamb. We have a strider. Uh, we have a breeze. Ooh, and then there's the, uh, the warden. We do have a warden here. Um, a... Ooh, we should have it have tentacles. Ooh, that's a good idea. Maybe I should have, um... Maybe we should have a... Some sort of, um... Ghast behind whatever we want and then kind of put the face in the center of it yeah so the tentacles kind of like pour out of the out of the out of the uh the thing like there uh crack on a, uh crack the desk open no no crack the desk open. in the middle of the air kind of like we're thinking about fell spirit green tinted translucent devil puka <laughs> no now we're not gonna do a we're not gonna do a, a vulpine as it was a D and D said. I was thinking I like uh, the steampunk sh uh, shorts; they're adorable. Thank you. I'm glad you do. Cute attic. Mm, pen tentacles. Uh, magnitude more than. Uh, the usual amount. Yes. Alright, so we have... Oh yeah, that's right, we have a simple creeper as well. Part of me wants to do a horse. Part of me wants to do some sort of horse. Uh, no, I should probably do goat. 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 Mmm goat goat feels proper Ooh. the lag on this is extraordinary hello Hello? Hello? Come on! I'm gonna- I'm gonna be closing this off for sure. Alright, close down. I think I got it. I think I got it. I'm gonna use... Close program. Yep. 
I think I'm going to definitely use a ghast with a, a goat, but I might want to use frog eyes on it. I think I'm going to use a ghast with a goat with frog eyes. How do I want to deliver it, though? That's a problem. Like, delivering this is going to be weird. I'm going to need... <sighs> Okay, uh, how much time do I have to do this? Horse Not, not what? good. Oh my god, hey he said it. He said it. Don't. Not what? good. Oh my god, he said it. He said it. Don't. <laughs> okay, so basically it's going to be coming out, going rawr, and right back in. It's going to be basically popping out, and then coming right back in. So... I think what we're going to have to do is let's get the camera set up in its position and then figure out uh, where the portal is going to be. It's probably going to be opaque, I'm going to think. And then I'm going to want to have it tear open. How, how do I want it to tear open? Um... How do I get it to tear open? Um, let's see about... Um, I want it to do something. I'm trying to, trying to figure out how to do this procedurally. Like some sort of tear in the air. Um, a wave function, a wave function may not be out of the question. Let's see what we can get. Let's see what we can get. I, I like this portion of it because I can just literally create something out of, out of nothing and just be like, ah, okay, this is a portal. Now let's bring in actors and let's bring in a new character. This is going to be Fell Demon. Fell Demon. Fell demon, and you are gonna have inside of you, fell demon, fell demon. You're gonna have inside of you, fell demon. Uh, you are gonna have a cast. Uh, models. Yep, we want a ghast in here. Do 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 do. Ghast. Uh, we're gonna want a goat. Gahoot. Gahoot? No, no, no. We want a goat, not a gahoot. Alright, and then. That's good. And then I also kind of want a frog in here. Frog. See if I can use the eyes somehow on the goat itself. Would look pretty weird. So let's do that. Gast goat frog. It's Book Poppers. Welcome on in, nice. Welcome on in, yo. Line of luck, hey! Well, if it is a book, I get it. It is, in fact. Alright, so we got those characters, and I'm pretty sure what we're going to want to do with these guys, if I just kind of get them in sort of like a, a combined location. So the combined location of them is going to kind of look like uh, this. We're going to want the tentacles be like here. Uh, let's bring it down a bit. And we're going to want to bring it out face like this. And then we're going to want to bring down the, the size of it down to here. And then bring it right about here. Right above the horses. And then it's going to kind of be... Right here, grab Z. There we go. Right there in between them. Good. And the goat is going to be kind of like in the middle of these tentacles. Let's go ahead and pull these guys this direction and back a little bit and kind of like bend them on in. Just kind of getting them in position pretty much. Not really doing too much of an animation. And then, uh, 
just to get an idea of where I want everything. Yes, okay. Pull back the tentacles down to here. Yes, okay. So we go to there. Uh, this middle tentacle needs to kind of get out of the way a little bit. The goat is going to go right about here, right in the center with its face around the tentacles. Right. The face around the tentacles, kind of like. So we're going to be right about there. Ooh. Ooh, the color is almost the same. When we rehew this thing, it might be pretty good. Yeah, when we rehew this thing, it's going to be looking pretty good. I like that. Okay. Uh, I think I can separate. Yeah, I can separate the head from the body. That'll do good. So now we can do this. Move it back a bit. And then we can have the goat head kind of like in the center. As a matter of fact, actually, you can have it float a little bit, actually. Let's have it float a little bit. And then the frog is going to be attached to the head. Let's see if we can get the eyes kind of like on there. So what I'm going to want to do is bring this frog over here. And I'm going to want to shrink its body quite a bit. And bring it on up. Shrink it down. Bring it on up. Shrink it down. Alright. And then we want this to attach to... Whoop. want this to attach to that. Onto that bone right there. Control P, bone relative. So that way... When we move around the goat head, the frog will come along with the ride. Still want that frog to shrink on down so that we don't see the body at all. No body. And then I want to bring out the eyes. There. Yeah, perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay. Scale up the size of the eyes and move them onto the outside. Yeah, there we go. And do the same with this one. Rotate it up. Yeah, this looks creepy. I like it. We just want to put them over the normal goat eyes right here. So that way we don't accidentally see the other ones. And then we can also kind of scale these guys up too. And then as the as the uh, goat kind of roars, the eyes are just going to be going blip, 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 looking all over the place. Looking all over the place, being all weird. Uh, green eyes. Green eyes and ham. <laughs> there we go. Fell demon! Yay! Alright, now I need some sort of portal in order to bring it in, don't I? I need a. This is probably going to take me the most amount of time. It's trying to, trying to figure out some sort of rip. Because uh, bringing him in is going to be pretty easy. And as a matter of fact, let's go ahead and uh, put the goat next to the head as well. Or the goat attached to the ghast. So we're going to want to attach it to the ghast. Control P. Bone relative. So now if we move around the ghast. Now if we move around the ghast, everything moves around. Perfect. That's what we want. That's what we want. Now we need to make some sort of portal thingy. Uh, we want a plane here, and we are going to bring it on up and face it this direction. Kind of like, maybe, maybe, yeah, maybe like that. Okay, let's figure out how we want to do this. I know that I want uh, the portal to at least have let's see here do we have do we have any portal uh layers here portal portal color portal particle purple purple puka nope okay we're gonna want to bring in a portal uh texture at least uh, we're gonna call this rip Rip in space. Give it a save really quickly. Rip in space. And then 
I want to bring in a portal. We're going to put this immediately into unused blocks. Uh, nether and nether portal. Bring you in. And you are going to go into unused immediately. Smoke particles go away. Thank you very much. All right. You. We want you to have portal as well. Okay. And then I want you to have un... Shading. Where is... Here it is. Okay. We want the color... Color and the alpha to go from here. Color and alpha from here and there. And we want you unwrap cubic projection. Okay, and that should give me a portal, right? Should. We'll see what happens. Uh, multiplier, cut that. We don't need that. Just want the alpha. There we go. Okay, so we have somewhat of a portal at least. Something that we can at least attach to uh, something. And I also want to increase its scale. So I'm going to want to put a couple of nodes on top of here. Control T. Get this mapping up. And then I want to expand on the mapping so we just need to take the scale and bring it up. There we go. So now we have a little bit of that. Uh, I'm going to probably want to get rid of the alpha. I don't want it to be transparent. I want it to be uh, opaque. Don't want to be able to see through it. So that way we don't see on the other side just the Kraken as it tries to rip its way through. And now I'm going to want to kind of get some sort of like uh, ultimate alpha on top of this though. Because I want it to kind of pull apart in like a pixelated fashion. So what I want to do is do a wave. Wave texture. Um, and we're going to... We're going to go from object... Yeah, that's going to be okay, right? Yeah, object. We're going to go from object. And we're going to take the factor of the wave and plug that into the alpha. And this should get me some transparent stripes on this thing. Yeah, yeah, okay, there we go. So now uh, what I can do is I can fiddle with this. Let's bring down the scale a bit here. Yeah, bring down the scale. And I want to rotate this in another direction. So let's go ahead and take this mapping. And this mapping is going to be for this guy here. Uh, scale needs to be 1. So that way we don't mess up the scale. Okay, good. And we want to do a rotation on the X. No, okay. We want to do a rotation on the Y. No, okay. Do a zero. We want a rotation on Z. Here we go. Okay. So we want to kind of go up and down a little bit and then bring that scale in a little bit more. Radio. And then I want to do a bit of distortion, I'm thinking. That might help out. Okay. So this is going to give uh, some parts of the wave thicker and thinner. Uh, if I go on the Z, that goes up and down. Okay, that's not the direction I want it to go. We're going to go there, and then Y. Yeah, here we go, here we go, here we go. Move up and down, and then on this X. Okay, good. And now scale in even further. Mm, yes, Y, X... I want this section right here only. How do I want to do that? Maybe what I should do is do a color ramp. Color ramp. If I go to color ramp, color ramp, color ramp, color ramp. Here we go. 
color ramp. Basically what this is doing is it's giving a black to white uh, gradient here, or zero to one in terms of alpha. And I can expand on that darkness section here, right there, and make that even more defined right there too. As a matter of fact, actually what I could do is uh, instead of linear, I can do constant. And we can just give uh, sharp crisp lines to what we want here. Preston, hello! Yeah, sharp crisp lines. That's where we want everything. Um, And what I might be able to do... Distortion scale... Hmm, bands, uh, sign, saw, triangle. I think, yeah, I think I know what triangle's gonna do. Uh... I need a nice thick area, actually. Okay, okay, okay. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Right over here. Let's grab this section right here. That's what we want. Okay, and then we can scale on in. Right here, and then we want to move up. Yeah. Okay, this is the section that we need right here. Perfect. And then this way, we can close and open the rift. So the rift can kind of uh, just like uh, be like... And then close on down. There we go. That's what we're looking for. That's what we're looking for. Okay, so now to give it more of a pixely, a pixelation term. Pixelation! And an easy way to do that is that we can do a Voronoi texture... Voronoi texture is kind of like uh, just a bunch of, shall we say, like uh, little sections here. You can see, uh, you can see kind of like it looks like a little bit of honeycomb, something like that. However, if we bring down the randomness to zero, all that honeycomb stuff becomes uh, just squares. So, if we do this into the vector and then the position... Thank you very much for the follow there, Pallid White. Pallid White. Plug this in. This should give us a a um a type of pixelation to the wave texture. So that way, yeah, see, now it's giving it in squares. So now if we turn down the scale of this, or turn up the scale, we can get uh little teeny squares to this. So now, suddenly, this uh, rift has become kind of like a, a little s pixelated. And we can do this with it so that the rift kind of like opens up like this. And now the edges, now the edges of it are nice and square too. They're not lined up with the portal, mind you, but here or there, here or there. No matters. So, uh, that seems pretty good. I like it. I like it a lot. Now I want to figure out a coloring scheme for this too. Like maybe we can use some sort of a uh, different coloring for this. Like if we do a uh, uh, a hue hue saturation value on this here, and then we were to I don't know uh, just mess around with the type of coloring that comes inside. Like instead of having it purple, we could. We could have a, a color ramp here and plug this guy into here and let's do a linear for this one. Plug the color into the hue. Plug the color into the hue and this might actually be okay. Yeah, okay. So now, now we can have some sort of like rainbow 
to it too. Uh, I'm going to want to add a wave texture in the middle of that. Let's plug this over here, this over here, this over here. Yeah, we're going to want with some sort of some sort of noise here. Let's uh, plug this into that. And that should give us some sort of distortion. Chewbacca, hey, how's it going? Looks better. It was looking uh, like a uh, purple zebra for a moment there. Zebra? Purple zebra. Yeah. Okay, and now we want to do a phase. There we go. That's a nice little coloring scheme to that. Uh, how do I want this to go? Do I want it to go from 0 to 1? Maybe what we can do, instead of going from 0 to 1, what we can do is we can actually bring this down in color. Or we can bring this up in color. Bring this up in color. So that way we only get a certain type of hue. Alrighty. That seems pretty good. Uh, should I attach Voronoi to it? We can try. See if that helps make it look a little bit oh, stranger. Might want to try for like a green portal. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want color. I want vector. I mean, uh, position. Position. I want position, not uh, color. Because color is a bit more random. Random. I might want to try for a another type. Let's try for a green uh, type section. So let's go ahead... And what we want to do, isolate the green. So the ice the green is in the darker sections. So let's go for a very uh, a pukish green somehow. Yeah, the edges can be like a, a tint of blue. Yeah, that seems proper. I like how this is looking. That's I like that color. Let's bring down the factor. Mm, value. Value? Uh, bright? Do I want it bright? If I bring this up to a value of 10. Whoa. Okay. Nope. One. Hmm. Yukish green. All right, let's do another hue saturation value on this. Or do we want to be contrast? Maybe we want to do contrast. I'm sorry. Contrast. And that might do better. Yeah, let's do brightness and contrast because I might want to bring up the contrast on it and that might help a bit more. Uh... Okay, I like that. And now we bring down the brightness? Okay. Kind of? No, that doesn't feel right. Although that kind of looks cool, though. What if we were to increase the scale of this? So instead of this scale, we bring it up to this scale. That feels right. All right, here we go. Here we go. I got it. I got it. We can go from search value. We can do a value here. And then we want... it to open up like that. There we go. So we're going to want it there. Not good. Oh, my God. Okay. And then we want it to open like that. There we go. So that's going to be that guy. 
Wonder where it goes, huh? <laughs> what are we making today? We're making, uh, trying to make a, a rift in space where a fell spirit is going to be coming on through. Nice looking fell spirit, right? Pretty. <laughs> and then what we can do here is that the brightness and contrast, this guy... You are going to go from here. Uh, okay, yeah. To that. Okay. Now what I can do is animate that. Or oh, We're... Okay. All right, now we want Not right here. I'm going to want the that guy to become that guy. So we're like just in a couple frames like that. And then from here, we want want the portal to start opening here. Okay, good. And then we want to take these, duplicate it, and we want to say the scale negative one to both of those, and then we want to pull that over here. Uh, he said it. He said it. Okay, so that's going to be the timing uh, of how much I have in order to do the animation, which is... Not good. Oh my god, hey he said now. it. He said Don't. it. Don't. Okay, good. So, right here is when the fell spirit kind of, like, emerges. So let's go ahead and get this into position. Right about here. Okay. Uh, we're going to want to get rid of the object transformation. Um, actually, not really. We're going to want to put the object transformation here, and then... And then... Grab and pull down, pull down below, there we go. Not good. Okay, and then... Okay, we're going to want the demon about right here. Lay down. Right now. Right now. Lay down. I prefer it if you didn't dig into the floor. Thank you very much, puppy. I wonder if uh, the green of the portal may uh, direct from the green eyeball. Hmm. Go now. Lay down, puppers. I know, you're good puppers. You just need to lay down. We only got a couple more minutes left, okay, puppers? You good boy. Wait, is that a goat? Mm, kind of. Kind of? Uh, I'm gonna want the thing to be sort of right about here. Let's see what we can fit inside of it. Right about there will be fine. 
object transformation. We're going to want uh, this to go away. And then we're going to want... Okay, we're going to want to pull this guy back a bit. Okay, and then a frame previous. We're going to want it to shrink really down far and pull it right below the floor. There we go. Give it a save. There we go. So now, now the the monster will appear on up. What? Oh my god. Hey, no. ah. Don't. And then it needs to disappear. Uh, about right here. Uh, let's do a lock rock scale on that. Oop, not on that. I'm sorry. On this, do a lock rock scale, and then we can do a reverse on this. There we go. Something like that. All right, so now, now I can, and then the portal will close. Cool, cool, we're getting it, we're getting it. Especially if they were ever at Eisner. All right, so what we want is for the tentacles to be positioned on the inside so do, 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 do. we want all of these things to go to reset here and then I'm gonna want them to Okay, and then reach outward beyond the rift. There we go. There we go. Something like this. Bring those tentacles on out. Bum, bum, ba, da, bum. Mm -hmm. Okay, bring it on down. Very good, very good. Ha! I should have the goat attached to this tentacle. <laughs> or goat head attached to that. But it's not going to actually be seen if I do that. So we're going to just add in another tentacle here. Alrighty. And then all of these tentacles need to do uh, something. Something wiggly. Uh, I'm going to want them to... I'm going to want all of those things to ba -ba 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 wiggle from point A to point B. So let's go ahead and work on that section. Give it a save. Poor Gastnia. Let's see here. Gas Tentacle, we want you to do what now? Gas Tentacle, we want you to change your uh, Z location and X location a bit. Okay, Z location. There we go. Something like that. 
Grab. Yeah. Something like that. Okay. Z location and X location. Thank you very much for the follow there. I appreciate that, yo. Fend rest. Fend rest. All right. Z location and X location. Grab Y. Yep. Okay. Good. And we want this to have a modifier of noise. Yes. And it's going to start at what frame? 61001. 6101 is going to want to be that starts, and then it ends on 6202. 6202. 6202. Alrighty. And we're going to want. Set it. Whoops. Set it. Set it. Okay, we're going to want the strength to be up there quite a bit. Mm. All right, and then we want the scale to be uh, pretty high, though. Yeah, that scale needs, is going to be... That scale is going to need to be what? bigger. Oh my God. Yeah, that's way too fast. Scale, turn that up even higher. Wood, oh my god, he said it. It's still way too fast. Wood, oh my god, he said it. Maybe a little bit too fast still. Wood, oh my god, he said it. Alright, now that we have that, I might want to take all of these guys and bring the points on in a bit. So let's go ahead and grab all of these tentacles. All of these tentacles. And I kind of just want to do a median point, median point, and then we just want to scale them down a bit here to about here. And then that way, that way we can change the scale in any direction that we need it to with the noise. So, if we put this all the way to the end here, too, then we can go again with this X location. Uh, X location, there it is, okay. And then that Good. noise. Oh my god, he got it. Alright, and then we turn, can turn down the strength a bit here, too. So instead of going way out there, we don't need to go way out there. Uh, let's go with gas tentacle, the gas tentacle, and then I want X location. I'm going to zoom in on here for a little bit. That'll do. Good. Oh my god, he said it. He said it. Okay. Good. Oh my god, he said it. There we go. That seems about right. I feel like that's good. Is Let's do a phase and see how far it goes. Seems fine. Uh, let's blend in just a little bit here. And blend out just a little bit too. Good. That'll do nicely. Uh, scale, maybe a little bit more. Let's see how far it wants to go. No, not scale. I'm sorry. We want power. Uh oh. Rinky Roy. Rick Roy. Yeah. The Ricky Roy. Welcome on in. Rated in with five people. How you doing, y'all? Glad you're coming on in. My face cam uh, tracker has died. My phone has died. My phone has died! There we go. Got a power backup on my phone. Hello! Going good. We're just making some sort of fell beast. 
I think this will be good because all I need to do now is go to like a Z location, paste this guy on in and change the phase a bit and it should waggle the tentacle pretty well. Like if I just... Good. Oh my god, hey he now. said it, he said it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Yeah, because now now this tentacle kind of waves Good. a bit. Oh my god, hey he now. said it. He said it. Perfect. So now I can go through all of the tentacles except that one. Let's go ahead and remove that one from our list. And we can select the X and the Z. Oops. The X and the Z. And then if we do a paste on all of those. Okay, good. Yeah, 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 yeah. If we do a paste on those, then we get those guys in there. Okay, so now we can do a X and a Z. And all we got to do is go from X to Z. Make sure we're selecting all of them for each tentacle. And then we can give a random. And then we go through and change their phase as well. So what were you up to, Rick Roy? Anybody that has come in, if you guys are wondering what the Puka does, what does, if I can type that right, what does Puka, Puka do? This is what I does. Why we do playing some amplified hardcore today and grinding out some basic re uh, resources mining cool cool got to get the grind in so all we need to now do with these tentacles is go the z and the x and just randomly change the phase to whatever the heck we want bang bang there we go and then X and Z, and then we can change the phase up. Z and X. Change it to whatever. Phase to whatever. And that will give a random number generator to a little noise texture here. Oh, yeah, we got both of those. Okay, got the Z. Let's go in this direction. Good. And then the... Oh, I know. We're almost done here, puppers. I know. I gotta... F I gotta feed these doggos is what I need to do. No, we need to go puppers. He's been a good puppers. Yes, he has. This puppy is waiting for his uh, F-O-O-D. I know you guys... You is waiting for your FOOD. No, no. You need to go pop, boys. Yes, you is. Yes, you is. Don't worry. No worries. So we will be ending here soon. But we will... At least finish up this little monster we've created. We're... Uh, that. There we go. Okay. And location. There we go. Alright, so now the tentacles should be all different. Good. Oh my god, he said it. He said it. There we go. So now... Not good. Oh my god, he said it. He said it. Perfect. So now if we go to the textured view of this, the rift, the rift comes on in. Not good. Oh my god, he said it. He said it. Don't... Or get rid of those bones, go to the texture view. The rift comes on in. Not good. Oh my god, he said it. He said it. Don't. And the rift goes away. So we also need to put in a bunch of noises. Roar. And then it goes away. Perfect. That's what we want. 
We're gonna need to get some head animation in there too, because head and uh, animation in there too. Let's see here. We want the goat section. Yeah, we're gonna want this too. Oh my mm. I'm gonna want this to go up this direction so that they had kind of moves around from point A to point B, so it does kind of look odd that it's kind of like moving around. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. I might actually want to slow that down. That's pretty fast. Let's, what? Scale, bring that up a little bit. Here we go. Yeah, that's much better. That's much better. Yeah. Uh. random fell spirit pops on in whenever you do some swearing don't swear kids you might summon a random fell spirit it's terrible is this inside the store yeah, 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 yeah. when you when you summon a random fell spirit inside the store it, it, the things kind of go bad thankfully you know it was just one swear you know Yo, the 3D Minecraft uh, Fox uh, is back. Hey! He's back. Give this a save. And I think we're going to be that it for today. So that way I can get these guys their FOD. Yeah. So we did pretty good. Got to show you guys what we uh, animated all today. We did a little bit more on Puka, actually, uh, as well. Journalistic truth or enhanced truth? I'm not helping you kill someone. We're not helping someone escape their fleshly soul cage. I feel like you're still, still hiding, hiding something, something from, me. from me. We need to, to give... give. Something, Something back. back. Poor sh**. Not what? good. Oh my god, hey, he said it. He said it. <laughs> Don't swear. Those words have power, you know. Especially around people with demonic powers. Is that why you like being around me? It's part of the reason. No need to worry about randomly summoning fell spirits up until now. Okay. So, how can I help you right this terrible sin that you have committed? Well, like, um, it's easier if we, like, just showed you. It's right across the street. Inside Stephanie's Chicken and Egg Factory? <laughs> no, but do you remember their slogan? Doesn't matter which came first, they're both delicious. <laughs> Chicken flesh. The vacant lot where we scared away the bake sale. Those muffins looked at me wrong. Pardons? Does you have spare coin? We not but broke robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, here you go. Don't give them, like, any money, Puka. Why not? Robots don't have souls. And how would you know? Long story short, we have, like, a deck gain of, like, zero souls and lots of spare parts. Spare part? I suddenly am questioning where my stock comes from. <laughs> And we are not even halfway through this animation. Not even! Okay. Before the puppy loses his mind, we are going to go ahead and raid on out. Let's go ahead and do that, shall we? Uh, raid button. Raid channel. I, I, I know, I know, I know. 
puppy. You need to saddle down. Okay. Let's go ahead and let's see here. We were doing following people. Ah. Okay, hold up. Hold the phones. Hold many of the phones. Okay, we haven't uh, raided into Andy Ray in a bit, so let's go ahead and do that. Start raid for that. I think we should go that direction. There we go. All right, let's get that I'll raid a message on up. Let's do a exclamation point raid. Box box brigade raid. Animating all the Minecraft boxing. That's what we do. Ooh, oh my gosh, she is doing like a Bob Ross here. Holy cow. She's doing a Bob Ross. Yo, it is wicked cool. Oh, with northern lights and everything. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. We are definitely heading over there. Okay, well, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Be safe, y'all. Y'all, be safe. So take care. Bye. -bye.